Hey. Crime. I'm no longer legally able to pursue crime according to the city. They took my license away. They said I can't have it anymore because of all the times I did it really bad and also did more crimes than I solved. Guys, but that's okay because the law never stopped me from getting the job done before and it's not gonna stop me now. We're gonna be playing the new update, which uh, also conveniently works with most unupdated mods, uh, which means I get to keep some of the quality of life things that I like uh, having on for this game. Uh, they just work out of the box. So that's epic, because um, I have some things I definitely want to try out for this stream, including, uh, but not limited to, uh, having an economy that doesn't immediately set you up with everything you could ever need to survive after you solve a single case. Uh, you now get paid much less for jobs. And it's a lot harder to find things like lockpicks. Uh, you have to actually consider where you're gonna find food. It's the hobo cop run. Today is the hobo cop run. Last time was the uh, permadeath cop run. The time before that was the psycho murderer cop run. This is hobo cop run. Have they nerfed diamonds yet? I'm not sure, but I've added a mod that nerfs diamonds. So, uh, we'll be okay. <sighs> Guys, I shit you not while I was testing though. Every single, there's... There was a um, creator branch for this game that I could access before that gave you like guaranteed um, only the crime type that they added. Uh, I'm not going to do that for this because I think it may have been disabled, the um, specific crime setting that let that be the case. But also simultaneously because it's not compatible. The saves are not compatible with the um, base game. So... If I ever want to do any uh, normal crimes again or anything that isn't dudes with guns, uh, I would I would struggle to do that. Uh, but yeah, there's been a bunch of new building types added, a bunch of new um, conversation types added, a new kind of killer with two different variants added. So there's quite a lot of new stuff this time around. But uh, I'll tell you what, guys. You wanna know what was really shocking that I've never had happen before while I was testing? Someone got murdered in the fucking streets by a serial killer. I, I get a lot of serial killers in my games. I turned it on today to see if the mods are working and someone got fucking murdered right outside my house and I walked out there and someone had time to scribble a whole fucking sigil onto the ground and leave a crumpled piece of paper right there in front of like a fucking building. Never had that before, cities have gone downhill. We're also not going to use a mod that makes the city's 10,000 people large. We're going to stick with a normal large city. Uh, spare myself some loading time. The large, the super large mods are good for novelty. Not so much if I want to actually have a uh, balanced game. Because my god. None of those people matter to me. Now now there's only like 700 people in the city and it, it, it makes sense. I can follow the threads. Shit mod? Did you ever think that maybe you have the problem, chat member? You ever think that maybe you have like a problem? Maybe you're the shit freak? Yeah. Maybe, maybe you're the piss and shit freak. They don't have that kind of introspection. Hmm. True. True. Will we solve more than one crime today? Well, I disabled the mod that makes passwords hard to find, uh, specifically because, uh, I would like to roll, I would like to see the new content, so I haven't 
nerfed passwords like I did last time. So getting into things should be more capable, like more possible because it'll have to be because everything's about nine times more difficult to buy. Guys, buying like a grenade, that's a big deal. Getting a fucking like password cracker, that's a whole fucking job's worth of pay to get one of those. So like, Things are going to be a little bit more scarce as the Hobo Cop. Food? You don't want to know how hard it is. Guys, listen. All right. While I was playing earlier, I had to go to City Hall and steal chocolate bars. Okay? <laughs> I couldn't afford a meal. A meal was $50. The total pay I would have gotten for finishing an odd job that wasn't super complicated was about uh, $150. Guys, inflation has struck the city in a major way. But it's okay, because you can still you can still pawn things. You can still do other stuff. It's just I, I've made this game hobo I'm a hobo cop. Who eats chocolate bars and drinks water from the complimentary water fountains at the city hall. Alright? I work from City Hall. The water is free. So poor guys basically imagine every single time my character is getting food in this game it is from stealing and I'm eating stuff like that dude from Monster House uh, every time I get something I smash it into my mouth stare at whoever I just stole it from and then run out the door as fast as I can and I'm out of there and then I say I'm gonna go solve a crime I'm gonna, look, guys, we're gonna be a hero. Miyazaki Murderer Returns. All I'm saying, guys, is lots of serial killers, all right? I run into a lot of people with a lot of fucking, like, ciphers they want solved. I swear, I don't think anyone that's played this gets as many serial killers as I get when I play. The amount of people drawing satanic sigils on the ground is a little ridiculous. I just can't stay away. I, your murders inspired them? New life, old man. This is a different Grup Grumble. It's always a different Grup Grumble. New life rule. It is really funny when someone has like a super unique name and they put their shit in a cipher that's just jumbling the letters of their name. And it's like their name has three U's in it in a five letter name. And I'm just like, you know, only you probably have this name. <laughs> you know, probably only you has this many U's in this name. Ulubu is going down. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Shit. That's them. The amount, yeah, the amount of times it's U letter, U letter, U letter. Like just three U's. It's constant. And then I would like walk over to the nearest phone book and wouldn't you know it, their name is like the first one. Their name is the first one. I remember that one time when I traced a phone number to someone that was that was fun connecting. The game, when you do like the game the way it's intended, it is very cool and fun and unique to like solve something. But then other times, you get to the crime scene before the murderer gets away, which also happened to me today. That was, guys, uh, there's been this new thing where there's now the ability to like automatically. Uh, Fat, like fast travel it doesn't teleport you but it very quickly walks you to your destination because you don't have to like do all the navigating with the arrow and there is one side effect and it is 
I am getting to this place while it is still locked down. And sometimes the murderer pulled the lever like a fucking idiot to lock the room down themselves, which happened once. So I ran up to this dude. I broke into this floor. He was the only one there with me and the body. I tackled him, knocked him out, and pulled the murder weapon off of his own body. He self-reported himself. He self-reported. He locked himself in the room with the murderer, like the murder victim, and then just kind of sat there wondering what he did wrong. I guess it must have been remorse. I also had another serial killer. Guys, because like I said, uh, while I was testing today, I had, I've had nothing but serial killers all day. I had one that was different, which confirmed it was just bad luck. But um, I had another one where I got a serial killer. I closed the case because I was like, I'm not going to fucking do another serial killer. We'll just like see if the next one is something different. When you know it, since the serial killer wasn't caught, they killed again. And when you know it, it was the same floor. And when you know it, it was the person who also lives in the same apartment because it was the partner of the person who got serial killed. Uh, so then I had just two bodies in the same room. And there was only other, there was only one other person on that floor. Wouldn't you know it, they were the serial killer. <laughs> it was just this guy and these other two, and they just killed the person across the street. It just keeps happening. They're not very good serial killers. I, I used to have... I used to have some seriously, like, elaborate serial killer situations... And today, all I've had is Doofus tries to make a cipher, baby's first cipher, and it's some stupid bullshit. And uh, they kill the, they kill everyone on their floor. But those are the two things I've got so far. Does one kill count as a serial killer? I would argue that if the person is making ciphers to make themselves come off as some freaking Zodiac killer, yeah. I, I would argue in the context of, like, freaking creating clues and puzzles. Yeah. We have Zodiac Killer at home. Well, they'd continue to kill if I didn't stop them. Guys, it is unbearably difficult to not install the murder people when I hit them on the ground mod, but I'm gonna be strong because I know that'll break my game. But I'll tell you what, it is unbearably difficult not to install the kill people mod again. I'm staying strong. Do it? No. I'm not being swayed on that either because I know what happens if I install it. I accidentally kill someone uh, and then it breaks the entire game and then the fun kind of goes away because we've already seen that play out and it was like two streams of this game ago. <laughs> that bit already happened. Wait, is it possible in the game with mods to become the serial killer and be hunted by a detective? No, but you can be labeled as the serial killer. You can go into the news and people be like, that's what happened was I got, I became the Miyazaki murderer by simply killing enough people in a game that they couldn't connect the dots who done it. And it was technically me. Although I will clear, I will make it clear. All right, I'm a fucking hero. All I killed were people that were corrupt. They were corrupt. They were in on it. I saved them from themselves. They were psychos. He's the Punisher. Yeah, it's like Hydra, guys. I was killing Hydra. All right. I was taking down Hydra. It's the freaking finisher. <laughs> yeah, guys, uh, you know, uh, legally distinct Punisher. We, we gotta make sure that we don't use the same name conventions. They were all Hydra, right? I don't know, man. All I know is that now there's apparently like in a new industrial kind of building. 
There's like a new slum kind of building. There's a lot more small buildings, like where like there's like not 15,000 detaching rooms, which honestly builds the world a lot better. Guys, they've nerfed the amount of people that live in like beautiful apartments. And now a lot more people live in grody, nasty rooms, which is good. All right, because this city should not have so many upper class in it. I'm just saying. And now there's penthouses that have like super security. Did the game get an update? Oh. <sighs> Bro. Did you see the new Seven Days game? What do you mean? Seven Days to Die? What other seven? The only thing I've seen today is uh, Into the Radius has gameplay for, um, they put out a gameplay trailer for the new game. Very excited. Seven Days Blood Moon game on stream. Is that the name of the game? I, like, I feel like people, like, what are you guys talking about? Like, is that the name of the game? Seven days to dying light two. Seven days to clean up these streets. All right, I'm just going to look up the first thing I saw. They're just stringing words together. It's not helping me. Seven days blood moons. Is a 4v1 fight to the death. Is this made by the devs that made friggin' seven? Dude, finish your game. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? Dude, finish your game. This is worse than Ark making their like remake of Ark. Like at least they've technically quote unquote finished their game even though it still runs like trash on everything and they have a million different expansions. What the fuck are these guys doing? I really like Seven Days to Die, but finish your game. <laughs> Please finish your game. I don't care if it's a different team. Finish your game. Because this game is going to be carrying over all of the engine flaws of the base game because the base game's not done. <laughs> you gotta finish the game. You guys are like still making sweeping changes to like the gameplay of seven days. It's not done. It needs to be done. Like the, the base core of the game needs to be done. So the, it's like a zombie hive master that summons it. But like, Guys, I'm gonna be honest, looking at this, the one thing that doesn't appeal to me in Seven Days to Die is cutting out the entire long-form survival loop of it and just having it be the seven day, like the seventh day horde mode. The game breaks down when you have more than like 30 zombies on screen. Huh, yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, nah, that's a nah for me. That's a that's gonna be a no from me, guys. Like I'm I'm still big fan of Seven Days. Like Seven Days. Honestly, if they just said Seven Days was a finished game, I would believe them and say okay, thank you, have a good day, do what you want to do. But they haven't, and until they have. I am firmly against games making spin-off games of early access products. All right, release your game. Say that it's even just say that it's done. Like seven days feels like a quote unquote finished product aside from when there's a horde night and the gameplay falls apart in multiplayer. But like say it's done before you try to sell me pr like more stuff. You know, that's all. 
I wonder if I'll live long enough to see Exanima finished. Exanima's... Last I checked, the, the like, Exanima is only really taking a long time because they're still working on the engine crap behind the scenes as they make Exanima for their, like, game that they're, uh, that they're planning on making after Exanima. Now, uh, I don't exactly believe that that game will come out in my lifetime. I don't exactly believe the, the sequel game will come out in my lifetime, uh, but, you know... If the only purpose of Exanima is to fund money so that they can continue to make this other game that's their much larger RPG they want to make, uh, then cool, man. I've had a lot of fun with Exanima. All right. I didn't, I, I've, I'm at the point where I'm like Exanima, I would say like, okay, yeah, whatever. It's finished. It's a super open-ended dungeon crawling game. And I don't, it doesn't like, but like, maybe that's just me forcing myself to cope because I've I've waited too long for it to come out that I've just kind of accepted that it will never be finished. Maybe it's just maximum lethal cope. You know, sometimes a game just takes so long to be made that you just accept that realistically it will never be finished. And if it does get finished, awesome. But I've seen too many situations where a game takes a million years to come out, and then, or even worse yet, it comes out kind of beans. Lethal Copany. Guys, listen. Anyone out there who's like, Lethal Company has some bad update speed, you need to shut your fucking mouth, okay? That game is nowhere near the level of shit that some of us have had to endure. Ooh, ooh, you had to wait a couple of months, bro. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Dude, I had to wait a year for Xanima to get a fucking update. I'm still sitting here waiting for Beware to get another patch. You're one dev video game. All right. Dude, listen. I, it's like everyone forgot when Phasmophobia took fucking six or eight months to get a content patch once. <laughs> it's like, does <laughs> everyone remember when World of Horror disappeared for a year and a half? It's okay to be like ravenous for more content, but you can't hold it against the devs. Like if it's an early access game, uh, I would say communication is required after about three months, but that doesn't mean update after three months. It means communication as to what they're working on. All right. And if it's only been like two and like there's been like updates, even if they're not gigantic amounts of content, dude, Make, getting like getting getting annoyed by it isn't really gonna make them work any faster. It's just gonna stress them out, and then they're gonna put out something that they don't really want to put out just to quiet people. You elect to play the game early by buying early access. I do not believe, unless it has been like a year of radio silence. A game is eligible for negative reviews because it's not being produced at the speed you would like, right? Unless they're missing the range that they detailed in their early access spreadsheet thing. Unless they are actively whiffing it and not communicating. You gotta keep that shit to yourself. At least give them the chance. You know? Cube world. Maybe that's why I have such firm opinions on these things because I have seen. Look, people. People now, their expectations for early access is that this production cycle for an early access game is going to be as fast as live service games, and that's that's a fucking crazy expectation. I better be getting updates every month. 
I better have sweeping content boosts every month. That's not realistic. You know? Well, there are some games in EA that feel like they never plan to finish it. Oh yeah, there are games like that, but that's that is that is optics that they earn over time. But like being like it's been two months. This game is washed. <laughs> this game is washed. This dev robbed us blind, boys. Let's get him. <laughs> it's just a, it's a little bit of an escalation that maybe maybe we should relax a little bit, you know? It's a, it's all case by case. You have to step back and be like, is this worth getting deeply upset about yet. It depends on the team size though. Well yeah, and that's why I'm that's what I'm talking about with Lethal Company. Like that game got super popular and then people got all pissy because it wasn't getting updates as fast as they wanted, but it's like that is a single dev and I mean from what I've seen from their other games they work quite fast and hard, so I would give them some credit and expect that whatever they're doing behind the scenes is probably worth it and not, like, get angry. <laughs> you know? I remember how quickly they developed uh, Upturned Hotel. From, like, when I was seeing trailers of it to when it was, like, finished. Yeah. And I mean, to be fair, like, look at how long it's taken for this to come out. For this update. The distance of time between the big update here for Shadows of Doubt and their last big content patch is about the same distance of time from when Lethal Company came out and its first big update patch that it's like working through now with like the beta branch. So I think people just use certain games as a frame of reference for content, like speed, like being output. And it's whatever the most active early access game they play is right now is. And if that, that dev is pumping shit out super fast, they expect if every dev isn't meeting the same pace that one is, then they must, there must be something wrong. Do you remember World of Horror's dev timeline? That was a long one. Yeah, that one was a really long one. If there's no update tomorrow, it means they, they died. They're gone. Valheim fans in shambles. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, guys. But, like, we all know Valheim's got new stuff coming out because they, you know, they talk about it. I think just communication is important. You know? I think it's just a lot of... I think one thing a lot of devs for early access could do more of is communication with their audience in ways that are very clearly, like, ah, yes, I can see this is the content that is incoming. Like, ah, yes, here's video footage of the thing that's being worked on. You know. But yeah. Listen, I literally never want to talk about this ever again. Do you guys understand me? I literally will never, ever, ever, ever talk about video games ever again on this stream. Do you understand? Oh my god, he's not communicating with us. What the fuck? As of today, we are done communicating. Listen, I owe you nothing. This is not an early access product. Ca Tragically, this is the finished product. Tragically, it's never getting any better. Damn. Okay, guys, listen, I want to get in game quick today because, um, 
Shadows of Doubt, I always run into this issue where I want to wrap up uh, because I'm like, it's been a long time and I've not had enough time to like get anything really done or um, it's like too late in the evening and I like have to wrap up. So the sooner that I get in game, the better. So we're going to we're going to start getting in. Now I'm playing with a couple of quality of life mods, um, as well as a mod that balances the economy a little bit. Because uh, I'm tired of having five hundred thousand million dollars in the first ten minutes if I'm trying, uh, so we're gonna we're gonna pump some of the costs of things up a little bit. Uh, this is gonna be the Hobo Cop run today. This is gonna be the Hobo Cop run. In a brand new city, new game, Sandbox. Generate city. This city is gonna be Marble Bar. Very large. Very nice. We will of course be playing Grop Grumble, our favorite detective. We will not be playing on hardcore today, and we're gonna be playing on normal game length. Everything else is on and enabled. He's no Columbo. Guys, I'll never be Columbo. I will literally never be Columbo. I'm sorry. Columbozo? What the fuck? How fucking dare you? What the frick? Kirkland Columbo. That's not bad. Uh, that's not a bad option. Like, that's not like saying Walmart brand. Uh, like, that's Kirkland Columbo I would take. I, I'd take Kirkland Columbo. Best value, Columbo. Guys, I'm not, no, I'm Kirkland Columbo, if anything. That's not too bad. I can take that. Now, listen, guys. Last I was testing this, there was literally murders on the streets. People were getting stabbed in psychopathic rampages right around the corner on the sidewalk. So we should be really careful when we spawn in, because it might get really bad. All right, people were getting slaughtered, and it wasn't by me. I'm in. As soon as the map loads, I'm in. You've spawned right next to City Hall. We love to see it as soon as it's done loading. Any second now. They should just keep the screen hidden for another couple seconds. <laughs> It'd be okay if you just made the loading a little bit longer to let it all load in first. There we go. Here we are, beautiful marble bar. Take a look at this place. I've still got the talking dialogue things, by the way, because I, I like those. I like that the NPCs make sounds when I speak to them. What's your name? Okay. Well, it is a beautiful uh, 12.07 a.m. on a Monday. January 2nd, I have, what the, lavender. I'm seeing, like, freaking black market dealers just leaving their goddamn graffiti right on a main sidewalk. Uh, but whatever. Uh, we're not gonna worry about that right now. Listen, I'm gonna go to City Hall and loiter there for a while, because they took out- Guys, I got bad news. You can't loiter in restaurants anymore. They make you buy food. And unfortunately, the food's really expensive for me. So I can't just go and buy food when they tell me to. So I can't actually loiter in restaurants. I'm not allowed. I have to go into City Hall. Hello. Take a picture. It'll last longer. Who the fuck do you... Stop following me. I'm not... Fo you walked into me, pussy! Another outburst like that and I'll beat your ass! 
All right, let's see if I can find a way into city. This isn't city hall. This is some shithole. Oh, never mind. It's the nicest hotel in town. They really need a better entrance, because if you told me this was, like, a nice hotel, I would be like, no, that ain't. <laughs> no, that's not. That's, uh, that's, a uh, that's not great. Oh, my God. Snake. Where the hell is City Hall? Hang on, let me just... Let me just... Look. I cannot stay outside for long. I'll get cold, I'll get thirsty, I'll get hungry. So, we're just gonna go to City Hall, and we'll loiter there until there's a crime that happens. Uh, I'm gonna just plot a route manually. We're gonna walk ourselves there. Maybe swing by the... Hey, Dale? What, uh... Is that pocket watch? Is this a, uh... Is this, is this one of those... Is this one of those pawn shops? It's a pharmacy. Can I just kind of quietly... Listen, guys, crime is gonna happen in this run. I'm sorry, I don't know what else to say. Paxidol, uh, moderate, to, mild to moderate pain relief. I'm just browsing. I'm just browsing. Don't mind me. I'm just. I don't want anything from this place, anyways. Ah, the newspaper. You know, you're. It's all your. Ah, wait, what the hell's Mega Might? Pungent yeast extract, extract spread produced as a byproduct of beer brewing. I don't want that. Wait, commemorative basbool. I'm gonna sell that. They can't actually stop me. Hey there. God, you're short. Okay, dial in, dial in, dial in. Uh, listen, we don't actually have a. There's no pawn shop. Uh, that appears here. I have to find it on the main map, but um, I might be able to Lock in on one of those in a second if I am if I'm observant is that one? No, that's offices. We're looking for a specific kind of building uh, Let's see here. We might have to walk by it once to, uh, is that it? Ah, yes, okay Reagan's Emporium we're gonna make sure that's labeled and pinned. We're gonna need that a lot. Okay, I'm gonna set this as my destination. We're gonna swing by here and I'm gonna sell this commemorative basbool. Hey, wa watch it! Where the hell is that idiot think he's going? God, they're swerving around like a psycho. Rude. Wallet gone? <laughs> never, never had one. <laughs> Guys. Once again, don't know what to tell you. Zero dollars. No money in the bank. I don't have any. They can't steal it. Because I don't have any. They stole your ball. No, they wouldn't. Hey there. I'm not following you. I'm not... I'm not following. I'm, wa I'm walking by you. You fucking weirdo. Lots of people thinking I'm following them today. <laughs> Don't know what's that, what that's about. Fucking place is closed at night. God damn it. Son of a bitch. I should have known this would happen. What am I going to do with this commemorative basbool? Getting cold. I'm going to die out here. <laughs> House plant cuttings all legally sourced. Ask for many foreign affairs. New taller housing plan. Love that. Listen, I'm just gonna go. Uh, we're just gonna go to City Hall, guys. It's it's our best option right now. We're gonna go back to City Hall. I'm gonna auto chart this path. Let's go. Now my character will just walk it for me. And if I hold shift, he'll walk it even faster. I don't need to navigate at all. He's doing it on his own. And then he got stuck in a little wedge. Uh, so I guess I'll walk the rest of the way because that's happened before. And I'm, I'm pretty cold. So that would, that would really fuck me over to get stuck right now while I'm so cold. But listen, guys. Welcome to HQ. Hey there.
I'm cold. I'm... Did anyone here have... Oh, fuck yes. I don't know why I have a fine already. I haven't done anything wrong, but... Equip it. Equip it. <laughs> this kind of stuff is going to keep me alive. Oh. All right. Now let's loiter here until someone dies. Hey, man, you worry about your job, I'll worry about mine, all right, asshole? <laughs> mind if I get your prints? Mind if I, uh, mind if I get you documented in the machine, man? God, I'm shaky. Fucking cold. Let's just warm up in this corner. Sit down. We're gonna pass some time until someone dies. We're gonna pass an hour until someone dies. Warm me up a little. Someone died. <laughs> All right, man, I'm with you. Let's roll. Let's fucking move. As long as I follow this guy, I'll know. Wait, I gotta grab. Hang on. Wait right there. I gotta grab the paper. Give me this. Eden murderer. Officer. The hell did he? Fuck. He left without me. Hang on. I can fix this. Aura one. Uh. Garnier Deluxe. Oh my god, this guy lives in the Deluxe building. Fancy! Oh, it's right next door. Alright, we're going to 401, fourth floor. I'm guessing this might- this room- this floor might be sealed still. I feel like we've gotten here pretty fast again. Ah, uh, fourth floor landing is one more up. It's actually unsealed. Oh, it's actually one more. This is third floor landing. One more. Yeah, yeah, open the door! Oh, shit. <laughs> Did you... Who the hell are you? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> someone in here. <laughs> Evening, what's your name? I'm not telling you. Right. Right, right. Uh, have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nothing? Nothing. Okay. Can I come in and take a look around? I don't invite Riff Raff into my home. Right. You sure you haven't seen anything unusual? Nothing at all. Do you know, uh... Listen, can I have some money? Not giving you nothing. Okay. Okay. Um, can you provide your fingerprints for an investigation? Get out of here. Whoa, shit, they're shooting him! Oh, shit! They figured it out. Case closed, boys. Let's fucking get it. This guy is really trying to teach me a- Oh, shit. Yo, you alive? <laughs> they just gunned that lady down. Were they the killer? The Eden murderer. I don't know how they figured it out before me, but goddamn. I'm gonna have to be the one that files all this. Um. Oh shit, no, you're still alive. Okay. Where am I? So, what are we gonna do about this one, boys? Mind if I turn this off? No, oh, that just leaves it on. Officer, can we turn the alarm off? Officer, I think that was the killer. I think they just, they just left. Can I? So 
to what happened here. Have you seen any or heard anything unusual? Not that I can think of. Damn. Keep your nose out of my business. All right. So anyways. So anyways, I broke into the property. All right. Now what the hell happened in here? It's another fucking serial killer. It's like every time. I really wish I grabbed that girl's freaking prints. Definitely them. I just have to prove it. I should have looted their body when they got gunned down. Fuck. <laughs> I mean, it's them. Guys, I literally have them labeled on this thing. I just need their freaking. Even I, I, I have everything about their build and looks, and I'm pretty sure they live here. Uh, yeah, that's a dead body. Well, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna go ahead and figure this one out quick. Uh, yep, that's the victim. Let me go ahead and search and analyze this now. This should be a nice. What the? Someone shot them. Okay, well they got shot. Uh, examining the body, it appears that the victim has been shot to death with a pistol or revolver. Okay, they got killed, um, a little bit ago. Well, uh, I'm gonna quickly take their fingerprint, just so we have it on file. I mean, this should be a fast job, guys. Listen. Listen. We already know... We already know who did it, unless they dif discovered the body, uh, but I don't know why those cops gunned her down. But, and then let them get away, but now we have the crumpled piece of paper which will give us the fingerprints of, um, the serial killer. Right here. Yep, right there. Type B is the killer. Okay, that is the killer. Type B is the killer. I don't care what you say. It's another frickin' Anchorinquams. I'm just gonna pick this up for a second. Take that with me. They're not gonna need it anyways. Uh, it's more helpful with me. I always keep trying to press tab to open my inventory, but that just opens my map and it drives me crazy. Q name. Yeah, the Q name makes it very easy, especially once I go into the um, address book of this building. This should be a quick in and out job, guys. Uh, let me pop into my inventory. just want to scan this. Just to confirm that fingerprint type B is, um, on the crumpled piece of paper. I'm gonna toss this pinned and connect that to those two. There we go. Just wanted to make sure that that was, um, specifically what was on hand. And now this whole crime scene's contaminated. Now the... Paula Villa is the victim. They left their wallet, thank fucking God. It has no money. What the hell? It does have a credit card. Write this down. <laughs> Guys, they're not going to need it. Or I'm going to need... I will need it. Uh, some cider. Am I thirsty yet? I'm okay. Whoa. Lucky break for me. <laughs> Lucky break for me. Well, well, well. Isabel Vega. Let me just go ahead and check your uh, fingerprints on your work ID that you left here, despite the fact you said you were going to work. <laughs> Little strange that that you said you were going to work, uh, but you didn't bring your work ID. Now, isn't there something a little strange about that, chat? Fuck! Fingerprint type C! Ah, oh, fuck. <sighs> it's never that easy, is it? It's never that easy. But I mean, like, guys. They literally gun- They were- They were sloshed, by the way. This is ridiculous in here. What is this? Matchbook. Tissues. Sharpener. The safe? is open. Huh. What the hell is this? YV. I know I'm not supposed to write this down. But I can't forget again. Isabel Vega. The safe is open. Huh. Well.
Let's uh, help ourselves to some keys. And etc. Oh yeah, that's mine. Gotta get whatever food I can get. All right. Ugh. Calories is calories. Dear Paola, I got your note. Sorry, but I can't hand over surveillance footage to anyone who asks. I ain't seen no Evertrite non-binary stalking around, though. If you got real concerns, put in a form 59.3.D to my office. Okay. What does that even mean? I... No, I ain't seen the most average thing possible. I ain't seen no normal height people around. I'm not really sure what else to, like, uh, comprehend that as. Tomato, come on. What the? PV paint. Paid what? Guess I gotta get into the micro cruncher to check. Oh, hang on. <laughs> We're good. Guys, we're not gonna starve. Why can't he be normal? I eat everything I see, okay? I'm eating everything I see. All right, that's just how it's going to be. All right, now hang on here. Employee contract, unnecessary. Well, aside from checking the, hang on, where do they work? Rose Ward. Do I have where they actually work? Rose Ward. I'm gonna... Guess that's, uh, the destination. I'm gonna lock that in. Uh, because I think we can probably go over there and check the footage. Did he eat birth control pills again? And beta blockers. And I may even eat anything else I see. Guys, listen. Grup is hungry. See, guys, for treatment of high blood pressure, that's me. Why are you so angry? And where's the insulin? Might help myself to that too. I may need all of that. Isabel Vega works at Heirloom Systems. May need to check with that as well, so we'll put that over there. Uh, blah, 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 nothing else. Ten tenancy agreements. Uh, this is a bank statement. Rose Award, late payment, gym membership, rentals. Lucas Yampir. That name stands out. I don't know who Lucas Simpier is, but I'm gonna put it over there just in case. You never know. Certificates of birth. Huh. Mid maxing guys. I look, I need Wow, they both put their freaking passcodes down, huh? Well, we got access to both of their accounts now. That's good. Um Anything else I can like use right away here? Business card. Oh, this is actually really helpful. Isabel Vega works at Heirloom Systems as a marketing executive. Damn. Fancy place. Pipe. All right. Uh, do I have the prints on this? Does comedy truly come to die here? Yes. There was no fingerprints on that. Hang on. Can I eat this? What good is it? Damn! 
No, not more pills. It's just, guys, it's just toothpaste. Hang on. Love running the TV. All right. Next step on my job, chat. I gotta, I gotta check this for prints. Make sure that I am looking at one specific print. Wait, inspect blood pool. Well, we know that goes to this. Yeah. Okay. What the hell is this? Oh, that's Paola Villa. Okay, well, I'm gonna help myself to some food while I'm here. Um, I know it'll make me sick. I'm just gonna keep some beef on me in case I get hungry later. It, it'll do me some good to have that on hand. Uh, knives, bullshit, bullshit, nothing, nothing. Just checking all these before I check the PC for the next part of the, um, the mystery. Toy car. A fire extinguisher. Fizz. Someone tossed something in the trash? What the? No. Am I sure? Hang on. Yeah. Alright. Turn this shit off! Had enough of it. Well, I really ransacked this place. You guys don't think... A murderer would have... Gone in through here. If you was a psycho, you could be anywhere in these vents and no one would be any the wiser. No one would be any the wiser. Take it from me, dude who spent a lot of time in these vents. You can get anywhere on one of those. Rerun bit. You mean me using a mechanic from the video game? What do you mean rerun bit? Oh, he's oh, he just crouched again. Oh fuck, he's taking the elevator in the game. That's a rerun. What are you talking about? <laughs> ah, tomato just opened the phone book. Rerun. He's not using only new mechanics. The frick up, man. All right. Uh, what the frick is Y Vegas password? Oh, not that. This nine three two six. Nine three two six. Isabel Vega is still alive. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the stock market and I'm gonna trade whatever. Fuck, it's closed. It's always closed. Stock market's never been open. Good news is, I have her full information now. Everything. Check the V-mail. On them first. Uh, normal bullshit. Blah, blah, blah. Normal bullshit. Bullshit. Hey. Uh, left a note. Bullshit. Bullshit. Alright. Uh, this lady was just gunned down after discovering her own partner was stabbed by a serial killer. Um, or sorry, shot. Okay, now it's on to Paola, who's the actual victim. Oops, wrong one. We want this. 1192. I'm in. Check their stock market. Any investments? Damn! They've never invested anything. Alright, I'm out of here. Mail. Please help. What is that crackling? I, th I think it's the PC. To Paola Villa. Sunday, January 1st. That's the day they died. Dear Paola, thank you for your note. You may be suffering from mild paranoia, a common side effect of the medications you've been provide provided. Regards, Miss N. Cucci. The charge for this... We'll never know. 
Dr. Takuchi, I'm sorry to send another message, but I can't shake this feeling that someone is following me. It's been going on for days. I've never seen anyone, but I feel them watching. I can sense a non-binary with red hair. <laughs> I've never seen them, but I know they're non-binary with red hair hair. <laughs> I can just feel it. <laughs> what the fuck? What should I do? Yeah, I mean, if, uh, if a patient emailed me and was like, I specifically sense... A non-binary with red hair. I've never seen them, but I know that they're there. I'd probably be like, yeah, you, the medication you took does give you paranoia. I don't know how else to describe the specific details you're pulling out of this. Huh. They must be- Paola must have been an empath. We gotta go- Hang on, there's more. I'm gonna print all of these. Just so I have them on hand. Take. Pin. Something something was going on. Stop. We're gonna get the uh, reply as well. <laughs> get this in. I mean, hey, I'll give this. I'll give this mystery one thing. It is unique compared to some of the other serial killer ones I've had. Uh, <laughs> it is. It is definitely something different. Uh, let's see here. Uh, last one is, Dear Paola La Villa, thank you for submitting a report to the Enforcer Citizen Liaison Division uh, that you are being stalked and harassed. I'm not really... I mean, this... She has no evidence. She... I mean, yes, she was killed, so I know that there is now... They were correct. But up until this... Up until the point they got shot and killed, they literally confirmed in their own emails they've never seen anyone. She is her only evidence. <laughs> but yeah, they apparently they had red hair even though she never saw them. <laughs> Tomato doesn't believe in empaths. <laughs> what the? Dear Tenant. Hang on, I'm going to print this. Uh, Dear Tenant, I've received multiple complaints about footwear disappearing from doormats and hallways recently. Please do not leave your footwear in communal spaces as the building management will not be responsible for replacing it. Oh my god, so you're telling me there is <laughs> there's some there's some weirdo stealing people's shoes as well. That it could be the same person. Wait a minute. The uh, dude, they, so they added a bunch of new emails and conversations to the game. So this is like I'm reading through all these now because this is all part of like the um patch. There's a bunch of new um like connections and things. So I'm still trying to sift through what is relevant. Uh, lots of new flavor text. Noise complaint. Look, Villa, for the last time, I'm not the one making all the noise. It's the people below me, which you'd know if you ever actually visited this hall. Too busy washing your hair and 50 credit bills, I suppose. Next time you get a noise complaint, you better fix it yourself. Because if you involve me again, we're going to have words. Reggie. Huh. I'm going to add that one just in case Reggie did it. Who knows? Lunch day. That's nothing. Villa, it has come to my attention that you've been running an office gambling ring on the side. Nope, don't care. Uh, does it matter? Does it matter? Inara, final warning, you need to get me enough crows to get our mutual friends to back off by tomorrow. I can't hold them back much longer if you know what I mean. Okay. I don't think that's anything. I'm gonna print it anyways? I don't think it's anything. It's too old. This is... Wait a minute. Wow, she got a lot of emails just today, actually. I was like, this is too old, because I thought it simulated... Uh... Oops, sorry, wrong one. Don't need that trash. Uh, I thought it simulated like a couple days in advance. But uh, no, this is all, this is all from just today. So I am gonna, I'm gonna take it and print it, just so I have them all. Though I don't think these ones are actually, I think these two are uh, irrelevant. All right, next step. Huh, their shoes are still intact, both pairs, but 
that doesn't make any sense because oh wait they're not wearing shoes but huh what we gotta go to Rose Ward. She worked as a nurse there. I need to get to the security room of Rose Ward, which will be unbelievably difficult to do at my current point in the video game. But for now, uh, I'm gonna check the phone book. I'm gonna check the phone book really quick, uh, just to see if I recognize, cause they did leave a cipher. They did that cool thing where they leave a cipher that kind of just, and will let me, uh, and per 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 jam There's t three J's in their fucking name. And a Q. That's pretty, that's pretty easy if it's in the address book. So, uh, let's see here. Reggie, three J's in a Q. We're looking for J's. We're looking at for, we're looking for a Q. Hector, Antonio, David, Yuka, Victor, Darcy. I need the handwriting. I need to know whose handwriting is whose. Because that depends on who they, who actually knows who. Oh, wait a minute. That's actually really easy. I have I have truly the means to figure that out already. Okay. P, remember your passcode this time. Are they writing to themselves though? Are they writing to I can't I don't know if this is them if this is like their partner writing. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So this is this is Paola. This is Paola's handwriting. Okay, so these are Paola's. They're writing to themselves. Instead of just jotting the thing down without including their own name. Uh, all right, so this is the section we want. We are looking for Anpern Krimjiv. Saki, Emil, Noah, Camilla. I don't think that this person, uh, I'm gonna jot down this whole address book. I don't think that this person who done did the crime is actually in this. I'm sure it's someone that works at their business. Uh, Cause that's really all we have here right now. I think we're gonna have to go to their business. All right, we're going to the hospital. <laughs> Officer. I was about to smash that door down. I was going to send that officer over the fucking railing, but I held off. Hey, I'm going to help myself to some complimentary water, and then I'm getting the hell out of here. All right, guys, we are going to. Uh, Rose Ward. Rose Ward. Fortunately, uh, it's at City Hall. Guys, we're gonna get so fucking gunned down doing this shit. Oh my god. This is gonna get ugly. Everyone, make peace with your gods. We might be- we might be hospitalized for a while doing this shit. Alright. We might be- we might be just riddled with bullets. So you're telling me this person was getting stacked in City Hall? You know there's a psycho on the loose in this building. What's your name anyways? Well, aren't we co-workers? What's your name? As if I tell you. All right, fucker. Whatever. Fine. I guess we don't work together. Second floor. This is where she worked before it all went down. Where the hell is Rose Ward? Which one of these is the hospital? Wait, this is first floor landing. Is it one more up? The the thing went away. It was one more up. Uh, for some reason, the directions disappeared for me. Here we are. 
Rose Ward. I'm allowed to come in here at the hospital. What am I doing? Wait a minute. Q Hoffman? Wait, O Hoffman. Hang on, can I pull open my... O Hoffman? Can I see the others? This one doesn't have anyone that works here. Why shall O Hoffman K Adama L Vidbar? I need the secure. Is the uh, employee records right here? It's never that easy, is it? What the fuck is that? No, what the fuck is that? With bullet holes. I just get the password into the uh, system right here? Can I just uh, get a quick... Damn! It's never that easy. Two seven nine ones. Kari Adama. Okay, well, that like, gets me in to the um, back room, which gives me security cameras, which gives me everything I need to know who was following them the day that they got the, the kill. Where are they? Wait a minute. Why the fuck doesn't this lady work here? Wait, where am I? This is Rose Ward. Wait. <laughs> what, they already fire her? The fuck do you... Huh? None of these are... She got laid off today. Fuck. Is that me? That's not good. They should not be letting me right in here. Everything's cool. I'm not doing any... Not doing anything wrong. Unless you count this as doing something... Doing something wrong. There's gotta be some employee records in this place. Orla Hoffman. Someone here is a psycho. I just need the right fingerprints. Type D. That's not it. Remember, we're looking for type B. Type E. Liliana Vidmar. That's also not it. Damn. Type F. Not them. Type G. Guys, what the frick is going on? What the frick is going on? Wait. Red hair. Always conversing about sports. Eyes narrow. Guys, maybe we don't have- I gotta tell you something. Maybe we don't treat this like it's some kind of detective. Maybe we just gotta take down everyone with wet- with red hair until we get to the end of this. We just gotta find one of them with a gun. You think maybe this- this character that slaughtered and killed, uh, this lady? This is gonna be like a Scooby-Doo cyber chase kind of situation where not only- um, are they like a psycho, but they also out themselves as being really into sports whenever they do like, do you think we'll find like another note that's like, I felt like I was being followed by somebody non-binary, red hair, and every once in a while around the corner, I'd hear someone say, play ball, but I didn't know where it was coming from. <laughs> this might be, we might need to remember this, guys. This could be important. All right. Wait. They forgot to lock the front door. Huh. Well, that makes my job a lot easier. <laughs> they No one ever locked the front door. <laughs> I'm in. Maybe I can get some patient records. This is locked. Damn. Nothing. Key. Rose Ward storeroom. No passcode into this computer. Anything in the trash?
See, this is a very tricky case specifically because if I don't solve the cipher, then I'm trying to figure it out from the security footage and doing it the security footage way would require me to do some extreme like breaking and entering into City Hall, which is just about the hardest place to break and enter. Uh, not entirely sure I'm going to be able to pull that off. Uh, hang on. I want to see the... Where is it? I got your note. Sorry, I can't hold, hand over surveillance footage to anyone. Um, this doesn't say what building this is average height red hair is like the two main things we have hang on wait hold up how tall are you very tall oh all right, Liliana Vidmar, you're good for now. Oh, shit. I gotta get out of here. All right, we're cool. How the fuck, how the hell is this happening to me? She doesn't even fucking legally work in this building anymore. I can't believe they fired her. Is anyone here with red hair? Larry Coates, Enforcer. Average height. Red hair. This person was allowed to wear a helmet for their fucking picture. How the hell am I supposed to know who this is? They were allowed to wear their fucking helmet? Whatever, I still got them. They really gotta stop putting these around. Hold your horses! Oh, I gotta get out of here. I'm gonna get in trouble. Uh, where's the phone book? Hang on. Guys, listen, I'm gonna solve this the old fashioned way by scouring the freaking phone book until I find what I'm looking for. Let's see here. Now, I'm gonna do this the brute force way because it'll be pretty easy. The name has a Q in it. Uh. We are looking for someone with a last name with a Q and three J's. So, uh, we will start with the Q as the first, uh, and, uh, initial here. No one has a last name that starts with Q. Not one. <laughs> so that makes this first part a bit easier. Next up, J. J, two more J's in the name and a Q should be pretty easy to fucking solve. Nope. And <laughs> this person's fucking done. Guys, wait, hang on. This fucking city sucks. This... What do you mean there's two rose wards? Wait, no, no, no. One's like a key. What the hell does that mean? Second landing. Fourth floor?! The fuck do you mean fourth floor?! There's two, You guys can have two rose wards?! What do you mean two rose wards?! Dude, this enforcer, wait. Iris, that's your room. Fucking dumbass. <laughs> Fucking this dude. This city could never take care of itself. It's all up to me. Rose Ward. The finest medical room we have. M. Kudo. E. Erickson. N. Takuchi. P. Villa. It's locked. 1192. Nothing on the inside. 
Thank God they use the same password everywhere. I'm sure they won't mind if I help myself to some syringes later on. Are the employee records out here? No. Is this unlocked? <laughs> man, oh man, we got Iris proves to me that the security of City Hall this week is not up to snuff, but I'm not gonna apologize for helping myself to their freaking assets if they're not gonna uh, lock the doors properly. That's not on me. Anyways. Damn. Can't you? Ooh. Hang on. Hang on, guys. Got that. Eat chocolate bar. Hang on, guys. Everyone, come on, quick. Or someone. Or someone gets me for this. Yeah. Come on. Let's see if I can get a password. Paperclip. Take that. Nothing else. Packing tape. Key. Rose Ward. Famously unlocked Ward. Not very helpful. Damn. That's poison just sitting on the ground. This fucking city hall is a shithole. Guys, I'm gonna be honest. This might be the worst off I've ever seen a fucking city in this game. This place is a goddamn shithole. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, e like, just unpin all of these guys quick, because, um... I was at the wrong- I was at the wrong building? Floor? So I'm just gonna go ahead and get these guys off the, uh, sheet. Cause, um, aside from you, you got that red hair. We're keeping you on the board for now. Let's see, Noah Takuchi. They work here. They do. Emily Erickson. Does that count as red hair? Type I fingerprint. Type J, Misaki Kudo. And then Paola Villa. Employee record. We'd have to go into the basement to get the security footage to see if there was anyone actually stalking them. I don't think... I don't think it's even possible we get in. Unless... Uh, you know, you never know. Maybe they use the same password as Paola. Fuck. We're not getting in that way. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna have to find another way to solve this horrible nightmare. Cuz, uh... That fucking thing is locked. Alright, here's the plan, guys. We're going back to the- We're going back to the phone book. Guys, I was on to something before I got distracted by having two Rose Wards in the same building. You think they just name one a different fucking thing? But no, they're both the same. Of course anyone would be confused by that. That's a common detective mistake. It's not on me. That, that cannot be... I can't be held accountable for that bullshit. Anyone would have fallen for that. Back to it. Back to, uh, what was I at? J? Any multiple J's in the last name? Nope. I mean, this is actually gonna be very easy. I don't have to check for that. I just gotta look for any last name with a J that has a Q and so on and so forth. A. We're looking for a last name with an A and a Q. And then we'll do this side just to be sure that that's not the other way around. But, uh. Just look for a Q. In this. Nope, that's every A. So it's not an A. M. Look. Or an M with a Q in it. Nothing. Nope. None so far. Miyazaki. Nope, nothing. Lots of M's though. Until right there, where there was no more M's. Uh, F would be next. Nope. Nothing in F that connects it. Which means it's H. 
and then we'll do it with uh, the first cycle as well, just to be sure that they didn't like mix it around. You're not going through the pages. You've didn't, I've been actively going through the pages. I'm uh, not really sure what you mean. It shows all the pages that are available. It doesn't just include that letter. It includes three letters. They're throwing you off on purpose? If I was a serial killer, I would write just gibberish on a fucking cipher just to confuse the, the detective. I would. Let's see. Ah, uh, Q, Q, Q. Q's. I have no idea how you'd have a last name that starts with an H and, ends, and has a Q anywhere in it. Nope. Okay, so we're going to do this one. We're going to start with A. We're looking for two P's. Nothing. I right, will look going to M next. And we're looking for two P's. Nope. Okay. Next is P. I'm looking for two N's. One N. One N. <sighs> People are pissing me the hell off today. Lots of prices in this town. Nothing. R. And we are looking for two Ps. No idea how you would even make a name out of that, so that's probably nothing. Dab. Alright, N. We already did. That or it's shuffling all of it. But that would really that would really inconvenience me off of the fact that um I don't have the full names here. If it's an anagram and it's all of the letters and the whole name, uh that would that would deeply, deeply inconvenience me. So I feel like I walked by it. I'm just not entirely sure how the fuck I walked by it. Okay, I'm gonna just check the last part again. Just in case. Might have gone by one. But the Q should be making this really easy. On this side, at least. No. A, we're looking for a Q. No Q. M. Let's go through all of it again. M has a lot. The Q, it has to be the Q. I did also add a mod that adds more difficult ciphers because the serial killer missions were getting very uh, easily solved. So um, there are more uh, cipher puzzles than there were before. All right. No, no cues. See, I'm just like, I haven't seen any letters with Q, like any last names with Qs across the board is the thing on any, anything. Or I, or this would be, this would be like done. We'd be done here. Boy, oh boy, if it's like some really fucked up cipher, we might have to look at this a different way. Fingerprint type B. Still no idea who could have had that. I love how you guys are like, it's this cipher. It's like, like I one know and two like could possibly act on that knowledge even if I did know. Ah yes, the Caesar cipher. Ah, 
Of course. It was probably L. Smiley. Got this guy dead to rights. I know it's L. Smiley. Getting just, I'm just so sick of these fucking serial killers with their goddamn... Dude, do we have access to the uh, security footage? I also don't even know, actually, if it's this guy. No, yep, that was... It's, if, he, if he walked out right there, that it would have been him. I would have known it was him, and they, were just, they just gave me a bunch of, like, fucking fake information with the, what they were feeling like the serial killer was looking like. If that guy walked in, clocked me, and walked back out, that would have been it for him. I swear to God. I'm going back into this for a second. Hang on. Do I see any cues in any of this shit? The addresses. No. Just doing this. One more check here. Just wanna, just wanna check something. Trying to see a pattern quick. No, I'm not seeing a pattern. Guys? Here's... Now, this is the only thing that I'm, like, kind of seeing, is that N and N align, the P and the P align. Hang on, I'm just gonna follow this just in case. I'm gonna just check in on Reggie, just in case, guys. Problem is, uh, listen, I don't have the money to... How's your problem? Sicko. Now, what I'm gonna do, chat, is uh, consult how much money I have in my bank. Zero dollars. Guys, listen, I can't call Reggie, nor is it very easy for me to look up Reggie on the city directory. All I have is his address right here, actually. I thought it was only the phone number. We have all of his information. Let's go get him. Come on, boys, let's roll. For some reason, I thought it was- I don't know why they're including the the addresses in people's phone books. It's usually just the phone number. Uh, when it's like someone's, like, home thing. That just- that just feels a little weird to me. But it is in the video game, so it's fine. I have all of his detailed information, and he- he is- Wait, why is he- Oh my god. But... That would be... The dumbest thing ever. <laughs> but... But, 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 but that would be so fucking stupid. Just checking. If this guy sees this, I get shot. Hang on, I'm just gonna knock. Reggie! 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 guy is. I have three lockpicks. I'm going in. Why the fuck was this room so green? I'm in. We know Reggie's not here. It would have answered. Alright. What the fuck is this? What was this psycho doing in here? Oh my god. It's him. Oh my god, it's him. This, the serial killer was here and he drank this milk. This. It's empty. He drank- No, it isn't! Still had a little bit left. 
Now, chat, we can't assume it's Reggie's handwriting or fingerprint just yet because there is a chance, okay? There is a chance that perhaps the serial killer climbed through a vent into this room. What the fuck? This is some serial killer layout shit. What the fuck is this? David Wolf, not who I'm looking for. Reggie Hardaway. Reggie Hardaway. Reggie, 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 Reggie. Wait. I fucking knew there was something up about that noise complaint thing, dude. And I let it go. Reggie, Reggie just pissed about the noise complaint. He killed them. That, that serial killer shit's nothing. That they they were paranoid from medicine. Reggie just killed him because they fucking annoyed him. Mother of God! All this other crap was nothing. Why did Reggie make it a freaking cipher though? That part I don't understand. What the fuck? What the fuck? What was his- I mean, his motive was just that he was annoyed. Reggie. Yep. Same handwriting. Guys, I don't want to freak you out, but brace yourselves. You're about to see something fucked up. Boom. Oh my god. That's the same handwriting. They're not going to need that. Reggie Hardaway works as an accountant. Holy shit. Guys, we got to get this done before Reggie gets home. I'm also trying to steal money from them. Yes. Yes. 18 bucks. That means I can afford dinner tonight. Okay. I'm in. All right, Reggie. 9363. I'm in. Let me take a look into... Oh my God. Red hair, non-binary. Oh my god! It's not long red hair though. That it says it's long. That's just red. They could sense it. They could sense it, but they at no point connected the dots that it was in fact Reggie, someone they had actively put noise complaints in about before. What the? Why didn't I believe? <laughs> Why didn't I believe the empath's emails? <laughs> Missing footwear? Hang on. Noise complaint? But who drove him to Crazyville? Who... Who drove him to Crazyville? They just snapped. Like a twig. Guys, do we have to check who's below Reggie's room? Because they didn't go crazy for nothing. They went crazy because... Because... Because there was noise beneath them. Who the hell was making all that noise? What the hell's going on in this place? Also, I can't do anything until I find Reggie and arrest them. Huh. You think... This would work with, um... Hang on, I'm gonna drop this newspaper. This thing is useless to me. You'd think, considering Reggie has this in 
their desk, it would go to this. But I don't think that's going to happen. Which is too bad, because uh, it'd be cool to, like, have footage of, like, I filmed every kill. We don't get that. Now, listen. I'm going to go ahead and... Nope, don't go out there. Television. I just want to see... One, if I can get another snack. Oh, there's nasty plates. So... All we know is they were shot. Our victim was shot. Now, I'm going to go ahead and fill out some of this quick. What is the full name of the killer? We know it's Reggie. Hang on. Uh, it's Reggie. It's Reggie, guys. Uh, we get 72 more bucks if we arrest them. I don't think we're going to be able to do that. I think we're just going to report them. Uh, do you have evidence that places the killer at the crime scene? Yep, that would be crumpled paper. Where does the killer live? They live at... Hang on. Let me... Hang on a second. I just gotta go into my address book and grab Reggie's name here. Uh, they live at 404 Garner Deluxe. Four oh four Garnier Deluxe. Bingo. Have you located the murder weapon? Have I? No. I mean, they shot them, but Reggie probably has the weapon. And I'd have to go to Reggie's... What the hell is this? Lamp. I'm gonna have to beat Reggie's ass to get that fucking thing. What if I stake out his house? I... Reggie works as an accountant, don't they? At Medallion Incorporated. Well, all I gotta do then is go to their place of business and beat them up. All I gotta do then is go to their place of business and cleave them in twain. Where's their work rotation? What time is it? Hang on. 6.30 a.m. Those two must work nights. I'm gonna have to find the work rota. Which is easier said than done. Is that another ring? Oh, shit. Blades! Oh, wait. That's people outside. That's just the stairs, guys. Sorry, the, everything's fine. I was gonna draw my blade, but it's people outside. Officer, relax! Oh! oh! You'll never get me until I've solved the case! I made it out of there. Where the hell is Medallion Incorporated? I gotta beat Reggie's ass. I'm gonna take him down. Let's roll. Don't worry, guys. That cop won't remember a thing. They probably think I broke my leg and went off into an alleyway to die somewhere. time. Medallion Incorporated is right here. I think. I don't want to pick it. I wanted to knock. I don't even think Reggie's here. No one's going to see this. It's a victimless crime. I'm in. Oh, shit. 
We just have to find where Reggie's work rotation is and then stake it out until he comes to work today. And then when he does, wablam, he's dead. Or I just hand in the case and he gets arrested in the next couple of days. Murder weapon or no, that's optional. I can't afford to eat dinner today. And I'm hiding out in a bathroom for possibly five more hours, waiting for Reggie to come to work, even though he may have skipped town. I'm just gonna go to the city hall. I'm gonna uh, hand in the case and, um, Reggie, they'll just get Reggie, guys. Well, I think I'll just get the bag, guys. Listen, I think, what are you, a detective? Who the fuck do you think you are? There's not enough space in the city for two private eyes. I can see you're also using the auto-pathing fast travel system by how you're walking through all these alleyways the way you is. There ain't enough space for both of us. One of us is gonna have to leave. That guy's really small. All right, well, um... Listen, I can't arrest him. I don't know where the murder weapon is. I'm gonna plot route to hand in. Guys, unless Reggie walks right by me on this street, we're gonna close it. We know it's it. We know we got him. We know we got him. They're fucked. Hey. It's over for them. Hey, yo. I finished a big case today. Did you know that? I didn't actually catch him, but I called the- I, I snitched on him, basically, is what I did. Um, I didn't even- I didn't even, like, arrest him. Nor did I get the murder weapon. Wow, the game is really struggling to process all the victories I've just sustained. Solved. Where's my pay? 282 bucks! Boom, dude! I can afford dinner! Plus 500 social credit! Now that's the real pay. Guys, that's the real pay. Huge. We're gonna archive this. Case closed. See you later, Reggie. <laughs> Why did it say I didn't know his fingerprint at the end there? I can now purchase apartments. Oh, social credit up. So, um, when you think someone else is gonna get murdered, what's your name? Can we be friends? Okay. Well, until I get hungry, I'm gonna loiter over here in the corner by the bench. Okay, is that okay? Officer Larry. I know all the officers' names because I uh, broke into the uh, security rooms. Larry. <laughs> uh, Larry, 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 how is it going today? You know, I just got paid for my first job today, Larry. You know, when the uh, call comes in for the next murder, I'm probably gonna where? Huh? I must have gone up too fast. Uh, elevation is a bitch, guys. Listen, I'm all lightheaded. Uh, there's not enough oxygen up here anymore. I gotta, we'll just take the elevator back down. I think I'm seeing things. Uh, maybe all those beta blockers and birth control pills I shoveled down my gullet and finally kicked in. I'm gonna take the elevator back down ground floor. I'm better. All right, we just kill some time until, what's up Waldo? God, I'm an asshole. I just couldn't help myself. All right, pass from time. Dude, I did that all in six hours. Wake me up at, all right, at 12.13? <laughs> Lunch. So then we kick back until someone gets killed. Uh, at 12.13, lunch. Till then, hobo cop. Thirsty. No one getting killed today? Dude, if I if no one gets killed, I don't have a job. I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna have to steal a candy bar soon. Get up. I need to drink water. Uh, 
I drink it right off of the faucet. Hey man, you have any food? Do we have any? Do we have any food? You guys know where I can find some food? Does anyone have... Do you have any food? I don't... I'm, I'm worried to buy something from the vending machine because I think it'll really depress me to see how expensive it is. Oh! What the... Guys! It's gonna cost every fucking cent I made to buy one fucking thing. Financially, you know, how about we, uh, financially, you know, we're gonna be okay, actually. I, I'm just gonna go to a nice mom and pop diner. We'll buy some lunch. We'll kick back, take some sips of coffee while we wait for another person to bite the dust in this hell of a city. Never mind, this diner's fucking locked. Is there anywhere open to, is there anywhere open today? anywhere that actually does business in this city anywhere at all dumpster dive for food I'm above that see there's nothing in there officer I don't even know if that was an officer I just referred to them as an officer they're open guys Legally distinct Popeye is open. Do not confuse it with Popeyes. The real brand. This is Popeye. It's very different. Hey. <sighs> Scoot in. And now, take a picture it'll last longer, Bozo. I'm a hero. I saved the world today, you know that? Fuck you. You'll never understand. Can't eat this. Fuck. Alright, I don't eat until 12.30. You guys know the rules. You, got, you guys know the rules, okay? What a fucking crazy world is it? You need to buy something if you want to hang around here, huh? Oh, uh, sorry, I was about to monologue. I... If you're not gonna buy anything, get out. Sorry, I was, um... If you're not... Okay, uh, I'll have one. Jesus Christ! $45 for a cola? Jesus! Girl! You're telling me that murder I solved was worth five hot dogs. That's it? I'm getting up! And you're a fucking scam artist, you know that? Fuck you. Is there anything I could just steal from the- I'm cool, 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 I'm cool. But I'm keeping this ketchup. I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. I'm leap. Fuck you! Oh shit, they're shooting me again! No, 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 no! No, 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 wait, 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 wait! Why the fuck does everyone have a gun? <laughs> the fuck away from me! I'm so hungry. God. Where the fuck am I? <laughs> Where the fuck am I? I just... I just wanted some food. <laughs> they fucking shot me. Bro. Can I get back here? Can I... Can I take a shower? In this place? What a world! Damn. I just want to solve crimes, but everyone in, everyone in this city has lost their damn mind. Fuck. Is there a towel? 
No, I'm just wet now. Just wet. Dry myself off using those sheets. Good enough. I think they're gone. Oh! Oh! Ask and you shall receive! Mmm! And what's this? Oh! A great bounty! Of candy! For me! Mmm. Birth control pills. Uh. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. I gotta get out of here. I'm feeling better now. How the hell do I leave? Actually a toddler? No, that's not true because I'm actually a greatly powerful detective. Um, and now I'm stinky. Hang on, I'm going back upstairs to take another shower. This this room will do. Nope, that's that is not it. Where is it? Wait, this one. I'm just gonna wash off the extra stink again. Give me one second. Here we go. Stinky's gone. Columbozo can't afford food. Guys, it's not my fault that literally no one is being killed in this fucking city. Okay? Fucking hell! Where's City Hall? What a world. What? Do you sell stuff that- God, it really must be pouring for you need that umbrella inside the food truck. Listen, man. Do you have any spare change? What the fuck was that? What's that sound? What do you sell? You are you- are you a store? <laughs> I'm cold. I'm cold. I need to... Hey, are you okay? Are you taking it? He's taking your shit. Okay, we're, we're gonna go. I'm just gonna go back to City Hall. Guys, I'm allowed to loiter there. That's my place. Out of my way! Wait a minute. So this is the life we live, huh? God damn. Is this for free? This for free? This for free? Alright, bye bye. Can I have this for free? It says food on it. Is that mine? Maybe this diner's cheap. That other place is a fancy pants restaurant made by some scammer. This place? No, this place is a good old mom and pop diner. Now, this is where you get the real food. Let me take a look at this. <gasps> Wait, Goodbye. I can afford is How oh, that guy going? Where the hell is City Hall? I'm just gonna rest until another person gets murdered. Or maybe I can pick up a side gig. I can afford things now. Maybe I can pick up a side gig. 12.08 p.m. Noon. I sat back down on my special bench that they let me use. I don't have an office like the other people that work here. I set my alarm for 6 p.m. I had a feeling someone would get freaking murdered in that window of time. And I also really needed to warm up. I was hungry and thirsty. 
but at least I wasn't wet anymore. I was too hungry. I had to find food. The life of the hobo cop. Thank God I had this. Mars old synth meat's gone. Checking all these to see if maybe one of them's unlocked and has food in it. No. Vending machine. Maybe it's stuff in here. Holy shit! Oh no, these are cigarettes. And like, pipes and shit. It's fine, guys. That's not the actual, f that's not a food vending machine. This right here, nope. There is no food vending machine in City Hall. When the fuck do these people get their food? Just here looking for some starch candy. <laughs> All right, guys. Listen, I can't wait around for another job to come in. So let's see if we can pick up one. Highly respectful and influential corporate client seeks skilled investigator to look into a business concern. Experience and evidence collection needed. Fee of $281, except call, we're calling that. Call it. I'm in. Seeks. Hear about the job? Meet me at Francis Street. I'll be sitting with a gem stutter. Can we, can you meet me here? It's gonna be cold outside. Fucking whatever, fine, I'll see you there. Francis Street. It's gonna be there with the gem stetter. Let's go. What the fuck is my... Huh? There. Don't know who that guy was, but they look pissed off about something. This guy wants me to meet them outside in the cold. In the rain. Okay. Gonna be one of those days, I can already tell. One thirty-three PM Francis Street. Does he want me to meet him here? In this trap am I getting pranked? The fuck is this guy? Is that him? Hey there. Is this more? Good. You made it. I need you to steal an important document. It'll be in a sealed red and brown envelope. Okay, I can do that. The leads for the target are in this briefcase. Take it. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> what do we have here? <laughs> Clocked. Alright. I got all I need. <clears throat> Right? Oh yeah. I got all I need. I'm keyed in. We need to find, I'm guessing, the details of... Locate and steal the item from the Mark secret envelope. We need to go to Ishi Grove and find someone who is truly, literally, completely unknown other than their height is 164 average green eyes. Lives on the 10th floor, lives in Ishi Grove. Okay, that's not bad. I can do that while I wait for someone to die. Guys, I get sleepy in this game. Guys, that's the worst thing that could have possibly happened to me. I have no clue how I'm supposed to get sleep with how poor I am. That is really bad. Let's worry about it after I solve this. Maybe I can afford the hotel. Ishi Grove, we're going to the 10th floor. What the fuck was that? They like slipped. What the fuck is this? Empty. Tenth floor.
There's some milk freak that lives in that room. Some kind of nasty milk freak. Someone on this floor is our mark. Best way to do this is to simply knock on every door until someone answers. No one's in 1001. No one- someone is in 1002. Can I please move this? There we go. We're looking for someone about yay tall. 164. They're gonna look short. Are they coming? I thought there was someone in there. Hey there. Inspect, activate. Tall, average, brown eyes. You're not them. I gotta go to the next one. You're not them. Next. Inspect. Activate. Blue eyes. Short. You may not be them either. So these two, these two rooms are nothing rooms. I can't get in them. All right, guys. Next step is to illegally break and enter into every room in this freaking line. I need to get to the vents. Or I go downstairs and I grab the... Wait, that's way easy. Oh, I should do that first. Hang on, guys. I gotta go to the basement. Let's go steal the, uh, like the, um... Landlord's documents for everyone who lives on the 10th floor and then I'll just like uh, get in uh, Get in once I know whose room I'm actually going for based on their exact height, which will be documented in their landlord documents Somewhere around here so Whatever room here has like a mark on it. I'm pretty sure it might be this one. Oh, never mind. Guys, someone got murdered. Beep, 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 beep. We got something more important to do. It's really too bad because we literally just arrived uh, where we need to be, I'm pretty sure. Or somewhere close. But you know what? Sometimes that's just how the cookie crumbles. I gotta go do this one other job so I can actually um, afford to sleep tonight. Everyone, there's been another murder. I have to go pick up something from City Hall. I knew this would happen. You can't rest one freaking minute in this city without something going... Damn. We'll have to worry about this theft case later. I'm sure it won't go anywhere. Back to City Hall. This is- this will be my eepiest case of a- where the fuck is that guy going? No one just runs like this anymore. Hey, what's your name? My name's Alemwar Cardinal. Yeah. No, I'm not done with you, I'm not done with you, I'm not done with you. Uh... Have you seen anything unusual? No, I'm afraid I haven't. I don't believe you. You next! What's your name? Keep your nose out of my business. Okay. Idiot gave me his information. Look, I just don't trust anyone that goes... Police officers going over there. Is it? Same fucking place as last time? Police officers sprinted over here. Smoldering Incorporated. Eden Slayer. I thought I just solved the Eden Slayer case. Maybe that was a name I had in another game. Thought I did it. Eden Slayer already. Eden Slayer 2. Guys, they did it again. 
We gotta go to Smoldering Incorporated. It's in Garnier Deluxe. This building sucks. A lot of people get killed in here. Lots of people getting murdered in Garnier Deluxe. Guys. The noise complaint. It must be the person beneath Reggie. What the hell? Fuck. It's this shit again. I don't know the way to get in here. I don't know the way. But it's locked. I got here too fast. So I'll hang out here and drink water. Wait, was that the sound of it opening? I can't like knock on the door for this. Hey there. What's your name? That's personal? Okay. Well, I can't get in there, guys, until um, someone opens the door from the inside. Eventually, someone will. But, uh... Hello? Yeah, can't get in. Hello? Hey, Tomato, what's your name and do you have spare change? Guys, do not ask me that. Now I understand how embarrassing it is to ask that combination of questions specifically. What the hell are you doing here? What's your name? I'm not telling you. Have you heard anything unusual? I don't think so. Are you fucking sure? I'm so tired of these people being like this. Got any money? Not a chance. Okay, well, you go ahead and stand right there, all right, while I uh, solve this case. Yeah? Thanks for understanding. Officer's gonna get really pissed at me when I do this one. No matter what happens, this guy's gonna get really mad. Gotta walk in like I own the place. After you. Yeah, I'll be on my way. Uh, do you have any food? Does anyone have any food? I'm allowed to be in here. There's some there's a company here. Some of the fucking IDs are blocked by this water cooler. <laughs> Just getting all these on the documents. Just in case. These are different companies right here. This is a different place. We are in a different building. Technically. To get in there, but this guy's gonna fucking seriously harsh the whole vibe. It's Larry! I knew it'd be Larry! Larry! Larry, Larry, Larry. What the fuck happened here? Hang on, I'm just gonna. The fuck? Oh shit. They done got shot. From. See if I stand right here, it looks like. Oh my god. Okay, let's go ahead and close that. Yeah, we're gonna lower that. Close those blinds. Just so people don't see me. They got all. They got all crumpled up. Good job, Agent 47. Maybe they tripped. Uh, 309 or Deer Slug killed the, uh... The victim. I see. This is... Lara Qualls... Is the victim. 
Got some money. Let me take it. No, we're not. Fuck a lot. They must have shot themselves from outside that window. Oh my god. <laughs> How could this happen? They shot themselves from outside the window, Chad. Smoldering Incorporated, Lara Qualls, head of HR. So they were HR. Anything else? Sorry, it pulled me out of the uh, thing. Nope. Nope. Grab that credit card. I don't think that matters to me. Organ donor, donor card also doesn't matter to me. Well, all of these irrelevant. From examining the body, it appears that the victim has been shot to death with a rifle. They died a couple... Oh, they died a while ago, actually. Never mind. We whiffed this one pretty hard, guys. Listen, they died a long time ago. All right, well, we have all their stuff. Uh, now... I'm just gonna pull this back open for a second. You yeah, see that? Give a good nice up a close look at this. Can I get... Got any... <laughs> These bullets have any fingerprints on them? Huh. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. Huh. Well... Let's put myself in their shoes. What were they doing at the time of the accident? They must have been here making a sandwich with... Excuse me, sorry about that. They must have been over here making a sandwich with a... That's a screwdriver. There's nothing in any of these cabinets except for pepper. They must have been here washing dishes, I guess, when... No, they would have been standing right here overseeing someone else washing dishes. That sounds like HR. Very good. I can't, hang on, I need a better angle here. Can I just, is there something I can? Oh! All right, now I can actually see what I'm fucking doing. So, from right here, they will have had the per, I think, I know I just destroyed all the evidence of the bullet hole, but that's fine. I can't track that, guys, I don't have like encyclopedia skills like fucking, like Disco Elysium, all right? I can't do that. I, I have no means by which to track the angle, okay? All I can tell you is it came from this building and that floor or that floor, okay? I don't have that many options. My eyes... Look, I... Look. I'm just gonna poke my fucking head out the window like this. Yeah. I ain't seeing no, uh... I ain't seeing nothing I can use to do this. So listen, guys. Here's how we solve this. First of all, need to find out who didn't like this person. Lara Qualls, HR. I'm gonna need to go to the house. And? I'm gonna need to go to the black market. It's gonna be a real pain in the ass getting this shit. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Hang on. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'll kill him. Dude, I'll kill Larry. Guys, I will put Larry in the fucking dirt he gets involved in this case. Is my case to crack. All employees, the door to my office has been reset to 1478. I just want to make sure I get in there. This fucking camera. Oh, really? R really? 1478. Open the door! Oh, there's someone in there. <laughs> That's why it was so hard to... <laughs> there's someone in... <laughs> someone in there. Fucking Larry. Who the hell's that? What is Larry doing? 
He gave up. God, Larry sucks. That's why I do his job for him. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. I mean, I just need some employee data before I move on. You guys know, you know how it is. Just gotta grab some employee records. Okay. Several. And I need to check for anyone that might have had issues with HR. Tindra Jacobson. Shuffle reports of flirting with other employees. Lock them in. A Lemwa Cardinal. Short temper. Several warnings have been issued already. G Yi Jun Kwan. They like sports. Ignore them. Can you dang? Short temper. Flirting with several employees. That's two strikes. Anna Conti. Short temper. Flirting with other employees and sports. That's three strikes. All right. That's three strikes. Ying Yu Shi. Too quiet. Strong character. Strong work ethic. They're fine. Aiden Mitchell. Loves sports. And Lara Qualls has been displaying signs of short temper. Too quiet, strong work ethic, loves sports. You reported yourself. It's a self-report. I go. Guys, relax. I'm back. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no. No need to hold my horses now. I'm just gonna hop on the old micro cruncher and hope that this camera can't see me from here. Anna Conti. Well, well, well. I will fucking kill someone they come in here. Larry, fuck off. Alarms and cameras. He gave up. Got surveillance footage. Hang on. There was no camera aiming at the room where the accident happened. Can almost see it through there, maybe? doesn't help me at all. It says that she's like present in it. I don't even fucking see them. I mean, Lara, Lara's not in that picture. Man, I don't know what to tell you. There's nothing else here. Lara's in this, walking around. You keep walking around. At one point... HR administrator comes in as well. Both just sitting around. Then Aiden comes in. So this takes these two off the table. Immediately. Those two are off the table. They have alibis. They were present at the time of the murder. We're taking them off. Let's get up. Wait, I should check emails, actually. I should check emails. Hang on, let me hop in there. I'm in. Larry, fuck off. To all employees, it's that time of year again. 
Okay. Can't wait to see you at Kensington Indigo Party tomorrow. Remember that attendance is mandatory and the punishment is immediate termination of employment. And don't forget to dress up. Qualls. I do not wish to see a repeat of last year's debacle. Attendance at Kendor Party is mandatory and we'll be checking names against the payroll list to ensure you're present. We expect you to enjoy yourself. Thank you in advance. What the hell? Anything from my person? No. Nope. That's it. Alright. Enjoyment is mandatory. Attendance is mandatory. Now listen, guys. I gotta get out of here. I'm getting hungry. And sleepy. I gotta go to the hotel and buy a cheap room. You didn't fucking see me. But I saw you on the camera. I know you're innocent. You're lucky about that. I'd watch your back. Alright, there's one thing I know about Larry is that he's not gonna save you if that psycho comes back to kill again. <laughs> I was told by my doctor I'm not supposed to take the steroids, it's bad for my knees. <laughs> You have a nice day now, all right? Guess it's kind of strange that suddenly you're the head of HR after what happened. Have a nice life. What was that? Did you say something? Okay, goodbye. Yep, you guys have a good day. A good, good day. Tell me I can't throw this commemorative bazboodle? What the fuck is the point of it then? Get me out of here. See you later, losers! Called me a flat foot. All right, guys, maybe we go to the hotel. We can get ourselves some sleep there. If I stay up another minute, I'm gonna freaking die from it. Maybe we can get room service, treat ourselves after such a job well done. I'm gonna go to a nearby pawn shop as well. See if I can maybe sell some trash. I've got this ring in my inventory still. I need to find a place to sell it. So I'm gonna go to Reagan's Emporium. I'm gonna auto travel to that. Go there, go to the hotel, get some sleep. Then, come tomorrow, we hunt down a gun vendor. There should be that we've seen gun advertisements before. We need to find one that, we need to see if they, they have a freaking like record of sale for anyone involving a high caliber rifle. Then maybe we'll be able to get somewhere. Hey, is someone, does someone work here? Guys, I'm here to, Hello? 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 Guys? The shopkeeper of this store has been placed under probation. I guess I'm not selling any of my shit here, guys. Uh, on account of the fact that they're closed for life. Never mind. 
Uh, I'm just gonna- God, that's the shortest fuck I've ever seen in my whole life. Jesus Christ. This guy is very short. Okay. Hotel. William Projects. Williamson Projects. Ground floor lobby. Get me- Wait! Fuck, these two are already sleeping in this spot. It's already taken. God damn. I would have happily slept there. Here we are, beautiful hotel. <laughs> Your finest room, garçon. Our cheapest rooms, 250 per night? Fucking Christ! Um... I might place you under arrest for highway robbery. Do you have any money? Okay, guys, listen. I'm gonna have to get a play. I have to sleep. Guys, I can't not sleep. Let me go outside, though, and check how much a cup of coffee is. Might be able to survive off of simply uh, giving myself caffeine forever. It's getting dark and cold, and there's this fucking building in the middle of the road. Not sure what that's about. Where the hell are the vending machines? Dude, I'm- I'm hungry. Cool, I'm cool. Gonna need more than that. Pepper, tin food, eat. Don't fucking shoot me. Don't shoot me. That'll keep me going a little bit longer. Ten credit hot dogs. I don't fucking believe you. What do you mean ten credits? You lie. You lie as easily as you breathe, you lie. Fifty-six dollars for a cola. Take a small loan of five thousand dollars, but it'll take six thousand dollars to uninstall. It would be so easy. Starch Cola will own me. I can't consume competitor products. No. No, 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 no. Let me just... Where the fuck is the coffee vending machine, guys? Good God. Or a diner. I have to do it. I have to do it or I don't have a place to sleep tonight. This is how they get you. Guys. This is how they get you. They got me. All right, they got me because they know I have to sleep and I can't sleep like this. I need sleep. I can barely afford the coffee. But if I go to a... All I gotta do right now is just go to the nearest... Go to the nearest sink disc store and I've... And I've got a hundred million dollars. I got a hundred million dollars in the bank like it's nothing. Don't you understand? Don't you see? This was always the only choice I had. 
starch cola for the save me. We just need more starch cola. That's all. Getting stuck on shit. It's dark. I just want to solve the case. If it's the last thing I do, then that's fine. They can turn my whole body into cola since as long as I finish the job. It's going to be fine, Chad. I'm going to finish the job. Use a better chamber to install or uninstall sync disks. Where's the chamber? All right, fine. Let's gotta put it in my inventory. There you go. Lay down. Install. I can. Oh. Guys, if I buy three more of them for like another 15 bucks, I can reduce the uh, uninstall cost, making it a net gain. It's okay, guys. All I gotta do is turn most of my brain into starch cola advertising. Gonna make the down payment. Wait. Non-consumption of- Wait, 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 wait. There's an unlabeled side effect. Wait, 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 wait. There's a side effect that wasn't on the box. Uh, non-consumption of starch cola products will result in blurred vision and poor health. <laughs> it's fine, guys. Oh! 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 We're gonna be okay. I'm gonna buy some dinner. This place is fucking closed. When are these places open? Oh, this place is open. I would like one of your cheapest meals. One. Uh, Nai Wong Bao. Thank you. Save the rest of that for later. Where's the hotel? I have to go to sleep. Williamson ground floor lobby, let's go. Can I have one french fry? And make it snappy, I'm a busy man. What was that? Guys, if I buy two more of those starch cola, if I can get sync disc upgrade things, specifically, I can, I just have to, I, listen, the, uh, the, the, <laughs> I'm not addicted yet. It says I'm, it says I want it. I've got a craving. I'm not addicted. If I was addicted, you would know. I'm not addicted. An addict wouldn't be thinking about this all so rationally. Your finest room. That is two hundred fifty dollars. Five oh four, guys. My vision is swaying. That's that's because I'm sleepy, not because I need cola. I'm going. Up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm definitely gonna. Pay. I'm definitely gonna pay for that. I'm definitely paying for my room. Five oh four. We'll go to sleep. Do it. We'll worry about the vision issues in the morning. I just need to get a nap in. As I get a nap in, and I'll tell you what. Is anyone else hearing advertisements with starch cola in the head? It's all fucked up. It's because of the. It's because I'm not. I haven't slept in 20 years, Chad. It's
I paid 250 bucks a night for this shit. It's fine, guys. I'll tell you what we do with our money. We're gonna invest. We're gonna invest in the stock market. We're gonna invest in the stock market really quick, guys. Listen. What do you mean I don't have a login? Oh, yeah. I know you're going to squeal, Mr. Franklin. You're going to give me names. How much do they pay you for a hatchet job like that? Brown boy, yes, yes. Gotta take a piss. Enough to get that family of yours away for good. <sighs> Shut up. I'm oh, going to sleep. You, Don't wake me up. Till uh. Don't wake me up till midnight. Good night. I want cola. I need cola. Put some life into it. I wake up, I stumble out the door. <laughs> I just gotta get some cola. That's all. I just need to put some life into it. That's all. Oh! You know where I can find a vending machine where we got some starch cola? You guys serve any cola at this joint, or is all of it just beer in this place? What the hell's going on? Anyone here still start Scola? How do we get this vending machine on? Thing doesn't even work. I'm hungry. I need starch cola to be alive. Maybe I just gotta order some. Thirty-four dollars for a starch cola. My inventory's full. I'm gonna have to drop something. That's fine. Just drop this commemorative best bull. I don't fucking need it. One starch cola. Put some life into it. Ugh. I feel focused and hydrated and ready to take on the day. Coffee machine doesn't work. Hydrated and ready to take on the day starch cola. <sighs> All right, guys. <laughs> Hang on, I need more starch cola. The addiction's kicking back in, guys. I need more starch cola. Stop. Put some life into it. Guys, I have to find where that. Do you remember seeing that graffiti on the wall for the gun place? Where the hell was that at? Lavender. Oh, look that up. We don't have. Listen, it's gonna be on a front bu like business. I'm already swaying. I must have only just barely fixed my addiction by drinking all of that. I should drink another. If I drink another, it's gonna fix it, guys. And it's really cheap from this building. I'm just gonna order another starch cola. Garshan. Another cola, if you will. Put some life into it. Put some life into it. It's gotta be where the gun store is. No, it isn't. In the basement of one of these buildings. Whoa. Uh. 
I was entering a strange world that I had never seen before, all thanks to Starch Cola. I was starting to see things other people couldn't see, and my addiction was really bad. It's, it's after about 15 seconds, I need more Starch Cola in my system at all times. And then my vision starts to sway again. I am fucked up. I am fucked. There is almost. You know where I can find Starch Cola on the cheap, my guy? Do you know where I can put some life into it? I don't even fucking remember how to find a goddamn, like, underground business in this game. It's been age- I've never had to even do it on stream in my life. All I know is password is lavender at some underground business. What's, like, the trick for it again, chat? Or do I just actually- I'm actually asking. Or do I just actually need to run into the basement of every apartment building to try to find it? I can't remember. Cause, um... Uh, Open up the phone book and find weird business names. Okay. You got Torch Cola, lady! Guys, I might have to start beating the shit out of people and cutting them up so I can steal their money. So I can buy Starch Cola. Oh, this is a nice alleyway. Hey. No, don't leave! No! No! Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Got any wallet? I don't have money. Asshole. Put some life into it. Starting to see things that ain't there. Listen, guys. I just have to. Listen, I buy one more starch cola and I'm clear. You understand me? I buy one more. I buy one more starch cola. Get another in the bag, and then we are smooth sailing. We we'll go back to my hotel room. I swear to God, I'm gonna solve this mystery. Just guy, I just need to carry two more cans of starch cola on me 24/7. Gotta have my fix somehow. You know, some people are addicted to. Drugs, hard drugs. Some of us are addicted to cola. Lots of, lots of cola. Just keep myself topped off. Okay? Just keep myself topped off. That's all. God, you're the smallest person I've ever seen. Jesus. What's your name? Margot Mitchell. Why? I was just wondering. Okay, I gotta look for funny names. Apple tr Ashen? No. Badger Cafe? No. Cart Captain Canteen? That's not it. Cardinals Plant Networks. Cobalt Essentials. Commission Clerical. Com Commission and Sons. None of these scream underground, like, gun operation so far. Explorer, Express, Fathom's Word. Filthy Laborer Dining Car. That's a dining car, I don't think that's it. We're looking for a place that I click on it and then it also says it's in a basement. Golden Clerical, Hardened Plant Limited, Hoffman's Management, Hornets, Hornet Artist Americana, that's a street place. Information Group, Garner Deluxe Office. If I set the, it to plot the route, it'll tell me which floor it's on and that'll also help me. Uh, Jackal Barbecue, that's not it. Kappa Industrial, that's definitely not it. Floor, oh wait, that's just 
Kappa Industrial. Lagoon and Partners. Seventh floor, that's not it. Laugadaki's Management, fourth floor. Lemon Incorporated, sixth floor, not it. Lobby and Partners, sixth floor as well. What the f Lucky Sesame? It's a restaurant. Medallion Inc. Millen's Management. Moser's Management. These are all these are all legit places so far. Omicron and Fort. Uh, Okada Grange Ground Floor Lobby Hamburgers. That's a big name, but that's not it. Singer Social Club. Cardinals Plant. Bar. Smoldering Incorporated, 7th floor. Guys, none of these seem to be underground, like, murder places. Triplex Solutions? Might be Triplex Solutions. They're in a basement. Tripl Triplex Solutions is one. Volunteer Lounge is not one. Wild Sailor Social Club? No. Whitaker Systems? No. Renworthy Management is a ninth floor. Most management one seems like no. Yang's Laundry. All we have is this solutions place. So Triplex Solutions is where we're gonna go. And we're gonna hope that's it. Let's roll. Oh! It's time to crack this case wide open while doing minimal work while addicted to, cr to starch cola because I couldn't afford to buy a bedroom. Let's roll. Listen guys, I may be addicted to cola, but I'm gonna make it out of this one. I, I just need to save up a little bit of money. Swing it back around. I'm entering the belly of the beast. I probably just need some starch cola to help my nerves. been here before. So that door's open. Oh. Yo, this triplex solutions? I heard you guys sell guns. What are you guys not open? I'm breaking in. Dude. I literally don't have time to wait around for such things. Oh! Oh! You fuckers sell guns here? Wait, this looks like a hospital kind of. Oh, there's just a, there's just a wheelchair. It's not a hospital. A camera. I'm on Ebor Starch Cola. This is the toilet. I need more starch cola. <laughs> Put some life into it. Fucking stop it. Dude, I'm so bad with the controls in this game. I swear to God, I don't know how to do anything. It can see me from here. Okay. Oh my god. Can you smash the cameras? I think you can do some stuff like that, but yeah, you usually have to hack them a little. Give me that back. Perfume. This is gonna really annoy me. 
Okay. I'm going to cut the lights so at least it'll take a little bit more time to see me after this. Guys, the cola was such a bad call for my mental health. It's cost me everything. Oh, it's not been making the beeping sound. Hey. What's your name? Listen. Listen. You have any spare change? <sighs> Listen, I wasn't asking, lady. Listen, lady, I wasn't asking. All right. It's okay, they're just sleeping. Thanks for the money. <sighs> Put some life into it. You fucking idiot. I'm too busy with another murder right now to worry about that murder. More people are dying every day than they're being solved. Buckshot ammunition, nail box. I have to get in here. Employee details. Gnome Aswad. Worst name ever. Jamarco O'Connor. Put these all on triplex. the only two files. This sucks that I can't do anything about this camera. It's looking right at me, but it's not understanding. Yeah, no. So you can't like just break a security camera? I could like throw something at it, but probably not. Oh my god, starch cola addiction is so bad. I didn't realize it'd be so bad. I thought it'd be like when it reaches red, I start swaying, guys. It's every five seconds my guy's zonked out of his fucking mind. I have no way to get into this. It means I have no way to actually check the records. God damn it. Whatever. Set, let them come. Matchbook. Oh, there was a turret. Whatever, man. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this one if I don't have a way to get into that camera. Might move on to the next murder. I genuinely don't think I have a means by which to get that one done. Oh my god, is this starch cola? Guys. It's fucking over. <laughs> it's over, guys. Unless I can turn this off, it's over. Oh! Which one of these statuses may be drunk? What status would be starch cola addiction? Just a just a C. There's no way to. I was look, guys. I don't think any of us were expecting starch colas like debuff to be this insane. I don't think, I don't think I can play with this. Starch cola addiction. Yeah, I don't have a. I mean, if I could turn off all things for a minute? I just turn off all statuses for a minute? 
Nothing gets rid of starch cola addiction. Ain't nothing in this world gonna kill. I'm not moving my mouse, guys. I'm not moving my mouse. What the fuck? What the fuck? Ah! <laughs> Guys, it's okay. I only have to work off another $5,900 of it. I've already used 500 of it. <laughs> Thank God no one works here because they're dead. Eden Slayer? Yeah. Uh, so I can tell you, um... That case is cold. Okay. That case is cold. I. Unless you're gonna tell me. Wait. 703 Johnson House. Hold up. Oh shit. Guys? They done killed again. They done- They done did another kill, I think is what happened. The case isn't cold because it's still open. Huh. Man, what is- But- I don't- Shit. They're gonna try to stop me from leaving. LET ME OUT! LET ME OUT! MY SODA! NO MY SODA! I WILL FUCKING KILL YOU DUDE! OW! HE JUST THREW SOMETHING AT ME! I'VE KILLED FOR LESS! I'VE KILLED FOR LESS! DO NOT TEST ME! Out of energy, huh? OH! Fuck you! Get the fuck away from me! You got money on you, man. You got money on you, man. You got a wallet. That's nothing. There ain't nothing in there, man. You got money on you, man. It's a utility knife. Four dollars. You don't tell anybody what happened. Alright, Isabel? Alright, after I solved the mystery of the murder of your partner? You know better than to snitch. Hey, Isabel. You got any money? Oh! Of course they fucking don't. Of course they fucking don't. No one has money. I need another sip of your soda. Put some life into it. Where am I going? Johnson House. Take me there. Seventh floor landing. Am I sure this is another... It says it's an apartment. It says it's an apartment, so surely this is a different thing. The, the other place is on the 10th floor. Well, fight my way in. Guys, I gotta move quick and fast, alright? Listen, I'm disabling all other meters for my character because um, if I have cola addiction, I literally cannot play with any other meters. I'll keep playing with just cola addiction. I'm not playing with any other meters if I got this fucking thing on my me on my bar because it is insane. I'm playing on a Omega hard mode with this shit right now. All right, what the fuck happened? What the fuck happened? Where's the- where's the body? Fuck 
fucking thing happened again. I mean, I still don't have any way to solve this fucking thing. Another 309 caliber wound at 703 Johnson House. Shot. This dude. I can check to see if either of them have like, like similar. Oh, no, can't do that. Put some life in. Ah, yes. Bazbul bat. Ah, yes. Who is this anyways? Is this Larry? <laughs> Larry? Larry, you know what? To You got any money on you, man? Listen, we're both part of the same team. We're all in this together. We're in this together, man. You and me. Now listen, uh, I gotta check the address book. Fuck, there's a million people these per this person knows. Did they know? Lara. Did they know Lara? If they didn't, then this person's just killing randomly. Oh my god. Guys, I have no possible way without simply checking every business. I mean, I could try to see if there's another place in a basement. But that's about it. Because I can't get anything out of Triplex as it is. I may have met, like passed one of these at the beginning. Is the thing. I might have passed one of the businesses. Cardinal's plant. No, that's nothing. Fucking god damn it. Commission and son. That's the t that Cobra Home Center, Cobra Home Center. That's another one of these places. We'll try that one. I'm going to the basement. You did good helping me. Bazball bat, Bazbool bat. Let's go. No, no, no. Open the. Grab that thing. Grab the Bazbool bat. Dude, it's so much. It's Bazbool bat's gone. You are not being followed, just your mind take the pills. <gasps> Put some life into it. Listen, guys. If I manage to solve this case and I ain't worthless. If I manage to solve this case and I ain't worthless. That means I'm innocent. I'm not a bad person. If I don't solve this case, it means even at my worst of moments, I was still the best detective there ever was in this goddamn city. I'm not washed. I'm not washed. I haven't had a shower since I was rummaging through that sewer on the second basement floor of that one building. Wait a minute. Telling me this is the same building? Huh? Open for business? Well, are you gonna like, let me... Okay, hang on, let me talk. 
What's your name? Lucy Blank, you gave me your name at the private thing? How do I give you my pat? How do I? Listen, man, how do I? I saw you two sitting in the bathroom. I know you work here. Oh my fucking God. They don't understand I'm on a time limit. I mean, I'll take ballistic armor. I have to go quick, guys. Pistol ammunition, that's not it. Rifle ammunition, deer slug ammunition. They sell all ammunition. Get me on this PC. What the fuck? It, they must have been using a Hamilton rifle. It's the same caliber that killed both of these people. 309 or deer slug. Hamilton rifle would align. My fucking cola addiction, guys. <laughs> Do not take out loads. <laughs> Do not take loads, guys. Dude, I'll fucking kill you. You come around that corner, it's over. What's your name? Got any money? Okay, I'm I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Answer the door. Let's do this above board. Ready to have time? I'm addicted to crack. Okay, listen. Do you have any money? <laughs> Kitchen knife, huh? I'm not surprised. God fucking damn it. I don't have time for this. I'm like losing my mind. Please have records of sale. Nothing. Nope. Employee details, not what I need. What's that? Sales ledger! We got him. Guys, everyone knows starch cola has nothing but crack in it. It's crack and starch. We all know this. It's crack, starch, and water. All right. Why, why are we fooling anyone anymore? Now chill, all right? I gotta crack this case wide open. <laughs> this is a credit card. <laughs> I'm like rambling about cracking the case wide open. I look at the fucking ledger I'm about to read and it's one person's credit card. I don't even know whose card this is. What the? Save that. We can use it to buy more crack. Save that. It's fine. There we go. There we go. G. Okay, this guy. Hang on. What a shotgun. I need to know... What would be rifle ammunition? This G Kozlowski would be. Hang on, one. Okay, so that was on the second at seven thirty-one. Okay, that would align with both deaths. Wait, that would align with Amanda's. Let me check. Uh, let me check Laura's. Noon. This would align with both of them. G. Kozlowski. It's the right ammunition type. I don't think this pistol would be it. But just in case, I'm gonna have them... Actually, I don't need to have them saved, because we have the sales record saved. We're going for this dude. G. Koz. We have his name, technically. Which means... We can find him. Now, before I do anything else, guys... I gotta find some starch cola. Yo, you got any money? Yo, you got any money? You got any money? Straight razor, that ain't it. Nope. Okay, you have a good day now. 
I'm just being silly. This is a dead end. Out of my way. <laughs> cola? This isn't a cola thing. Where's the hotel? They sell the cheapest cola in town. Anywhere else I try to buy cola, they're gonna rip me off. They're gonna scam me. I, could, I only buy cola from my favorite cola joint. Starch Cola has a business sponsorship agreement partnership with the hotel. It's the perfect scheme. I just don't know how to get back there to solve this mystery. I gotta crack this case wide open. Oh. I need a crack. Do you think anyone sells starch cola on shelves? Do you think anyone sells starch cola on... 56 dollars for a starch cola. Where's the hotel? Where's the hotel? They sell the cheapest starch cola in town. Don't you know that they have a big deal? They have a big deal with starch cola. I need to get to the hotel. Yeah, my heart rate's going at about 250 BPM. I'm doing great. My inventory is full. I gotta drop something. Whose ring is this? No, I'm not married. Give me one of these. Put some life into it. I need to make more inventory space. I already had starch cola on me. Huh? What? Huh? What? Huh? What? Doesn't matter. Focus. The world needs you. Don't attack it with your sword. Read it. Read it. G cause. Kaz. No. G Kozlowski. 901 Ishi Grove. Well, 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 I'd say that I have time to investigate carefully, but. <laughs> Let me check how my debt's doing, you know? Maybe we do have time. I only own 500 more credits. If I have anything that isn't starch cola in my system, the bill goes up $10. Do you understand? Just draw the fucking sword now. <laughs> Ninth floor. I'm gonna take the elevator. This is dumb. What the? Me in. Crack open a nice, delicious starch cola. Put some life in. Hello? Hello? I'm here to talk to you about starch cola. Hey there. I interest you in a drink. What's your name, son? 
Yeah. Put some life into it. Oh! I'm gonna need to check your fingerprints on that can. I'm gonna need to check your fingerprints on that there can. You understand. Type Y fingerprint. Eugene Kowalski! Kowalski! Starch Cola. <laughs> I'm gonna have to confiscate that. When will they learn? When will they learn? Rifle ammunition. Should have known. Anything else? No gun. You stay right there. Alright, I'm not done with you. Grigor Kozlowski. You got money? A hundred and nine dollars. Well, you just paid for my cola bill. Ain't that something? Well, 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 well. Now, where you keep your gun, man? Where you keep the gun, man? Well, well, well. Now, that's gonna make me even taller. You drank all of it, you little bitch! Fuck! <laughs> Hang on, what's this say? I can't read this shit. <laughs> this even... Nest of vipers, not one of them innocent. Trash, all trash, give them something to think about. And you know who caught him? A detective kicked his door down after handing him a promotional can of soda and fucking found his manifesto while totally zonked on like a lone addiction for cola. Okay. Sometimes that's just how this life plays out. What the? Hardened plant. Doesn't matter anymore. His pants are on the ground. I don't know the way into his... I don't know the way into his fucking... Safe. Two seven six seven. This guy doesn't have any cola in this place, which means at a certain point I will fund. Wait a minute. Damn, he's one of those milk drinkers. <laughs> I, I can't live off of this. He's got a camera. I don't need armor. All right, that's for pansies. Nice. Turn these on. Turn the burner on. Oh, there it is. Guys, I found it. And when you know... Uh... Yeah, there it is. Go ahead and pin that. It's a murder weapon. So, uh, we did find him. Uh, yep, we are gonna go ahead and punch all this in. We're looking at Grigor Kowalski was the killer. I can't arrest him, but I can maim him. Uh, do you have evidence that places the killer at the scene- at a crime scene? Uh, well, yeah, I have this- this gun. Or technically that psycho note? I think it'd be the gun or the note. Probably not the note. Probably the gun. I'm gonna say the gun. Where does the killer live? Uh, 901 Ishi Grove. Have you located the murder weapon? Yeah. Can't arrest him. Guys, there's nothing I can do about that. Oh, shit! Wow, <laughs> You have a good one, freak. You have a good one. They locked me in. When you wake up, you're gonna be arrested. O officer? Officer, actually, can I just, like, have you come with me to arrest someone? Bye. Okay. Well, he'll have to make another trip over in a little bit.
Didn't you have the key? Sometimes it's just fun to kick it down. What's wrong with my DNA? Oh, oh yeah. Gotta have a new sync disc. Yeah. You know, guys, I may be addicted to starch cola, but you know what? My life ain't so bad. God damn, that guy's got some cakes down there. Jesus Christ, man. What the... What the hell is that? All right, let's go. Officer? Or City Hall. I don't know where I is. I don't know where I is. Gotta go back to the ground floor of the City Hall. We can buy some more soda on the way. Hang on, I'm actually gonna install this sink clinic disc. I need to make myself even better. More powerful. Stronger. Install a new sync disc. I elect to become 15% taller. Oh. Oh. Uh. Put some life into it. addicted to starch cola but he gets the job done he's one of the best and in case damn no one can say we're not the best at our job guys check we didn't apparently the evidence placing the killer at the scene of the crime was not it but then again he did both of his crimes with a gun, so I'm not really sure how I could possibly have placed him at the scene of the crime. Uh, he wasn't technically at either of the scenes, game. I can loiter at bars and restaurants now! Guys, my social credit's up to level three! You literally can't kick me out now. No one can make me leave now. Sorry about that. That wasn't actually my plan. I'm out of soda. Get me another soda. Now. Only $41. Why, I'm willing to buy that. Thank you. You know, I just closed a case today. You know, I just closed another case today. Guess I'll get back on that theft job. Oh yeah, there was also an Ishi Grove. Okay. On the 10th floor. You know, back in the day, last time I was over here on Ishi Grove, I used to, like, care about my reputation, so I didn't want to just smash a door down and fucking kill someone in order to get my point across and get what I need, but now I'm over it. I'm gonna go straight up to the 10th floor, I'm gonna punch every door down, I'm gonna kill anyone that tries to stop me, and then I'm gonna get the envelope I need. Remember, I need to find a marked secret envelope somewhere inside of each of their rooms. One of the rooms has a marked secret envelope, and the only thing I know about who owns that room that has the marked secret envelope is that they're 164 centimeters tall and their build is average and their eyes are green. Put some life into it. guy wasn't here last time. Hey there! You don't look average, right? Wait a minute. Green eyes. Can I interest you in a starch cola? It's not stolen. I bought it with my own money. <laughs> <laughs> 
I need that cola. I need that. I, I, I just, I, I, I didn't mean to give it to you. Can I have that back? All right, it's fine. It's fine. Ugh! But I am going to need it back, though. Thank you. Listen, you don't even want it. Where's that envelope at? What the hell? What a world. What a world. Anyways. Hmm. All right, guys, keep your eyes peeled for an envelope. Work ID. Oh, a wallet. Ooh, money. 110 bucks. Don't get up. All right, that would be bad for you if you got up. Listen, I don't want to do a tragedy in this room, but I fucking will. I gotta lock this. I don't want anyone. Never mind, it's already locked. Keep your eyes peeled for an envelope, guys. Matchbox, that's not it. Envelope. Envelope. And soda, honestly. Soda would be cool. Oh, to find a starch cola in a place like this. Ooh, seven dollars. Don't mind if I do. My poor addiction. Good God. They're wiggling around. No envelope. Starch candy, I can eat that! Fuck. No, I can't, I don't have the space. Quiet. Oh. Shoulda just stayed down. Shoulda just stayed down. Envelope? Looking for an envelope. No cola either. What kind of fucking place is this? Envelope? Envelope. Fourteen dollars. I'll take that. Beta blockers? Can't eat those. They're not starch cola. Deer slug rounds. Jess, remember the passcode this time? Doesn't matter to me. It's in the safe. If it's in their safe, I'm fucked. Diamond? I mean, <laughs> the amount of cola I could get with a diamond. <laughs> the amount of cola I could get with a diamond. It's been some time since I've seen a diamond. That would keep me afloat for some time. To have a diamond like that. Guys, where the hell is it? Hang on, I gotta take another sippy of starch cola. Where the hell is this envelope? They said it would mark, locate, and steal the item from the mark. Secret envelope. Bro, where the hell did you put the envelope? I know it's secret, but come on. Get the fuck out of here. All right, don't even bother. I'm not playing around. Where the hell is the envelope? Don't get up. Are you sure this is the right place? Yeah, short guy. Oh! Ah! Stuck in the you guys are just having a bad dream that's recurring. Alright, it's just a recurring bad dream. Everything's fine. Where the hell is the envelope?
what the hell's going on out there? No, 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 none of this is what I need. Listen, I'll stop looking for the envelope when someone dies. When someone dies, I swear to God, I'm clear. You'll never hear from me again. But someone's gotta die. That's the rules. I don't make them. Is it possible that they put it somewhere in like the bookshelf? Son of a bitch. Yeah, sound the fucking alarm. Yeah, keep on trying. Eventually you'll get there. It would be pretty embarrassing. Guys, listen. All right. It's average green eyes dude. All right. We already know it's him. Look, I'll show you. Once again. Wait, how did he get my soda? Dude, drop my fucking soda. John Rodriguez. John. Where does John work? It's the best, it's the next best option. Desk Lab Networks. Look, he fits all the stuff. I have his passcode. J6747. It's not under his bed, is it? No. 6747. We're just going to punch it in. I just need another sip of your soda. I'm okay, guys. Everything is fine. I turned off the computer again. That's gonna set me back. I just have to... I just have to get in there. Six, seven... Five... Six, seven... Four, seven. I'm in. Gonna need your profile first, John. Don't want to be missing any details. Gotta check your mail. John. Had it with your slacking off. Guys, I'm not, if it's not at his place of work. How many times I gotta teach you this lesson, you two? God damn. If it's not at his place of work, I don't know where it could be. Genuinely. But I don't have a million years to sit around and check. Not with my crippling addiction. I've got... I'm getting those shakes, guys. Guys, I'm getting the shakes. I think I have to go. I don't think I have a choice. Alright, we're gonna go to his place of business. Desk Lab Networks. You have a good day, John. What are the odds it's actually at this fucking place of work, though? That's dumb. That's dumb. I'm running out of soda. I'm out of soda. So now I'm like a detective that leaves it. Get off of me. Get off of me. I'm like a detective that leaves a little paper trail everywhere he's gone. Because wherever I am, you'll know because there's going to be a bunch of soda cans. Can't help myself. I love what I like. Waldo? Waldo looking ass? Over there? Do you see it for a second? It was him. 
What floor is this on? Fuck. Eighth. Tomato, you can't say Waldo looking ass to strangers. I can as long as they're dressing up like Waldo. Which one of these buildings is the right one? Dude, I don't have time to fucking care about this shit. Does that have any machine? Cigars, none of it's what I need. That camera's gonna fucking kill me if it sees me do this shit. Good news is it ain't. I'm in. <sighs> I have no idea which one of these fucking desks he worked at. If I'm e or if I'm even in the right place, this is. Check every desk. And drink some soda. Holy shit. No, 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 no. Guys? Something's wrong with my character. For some reason he wasn't, like, moving properly. No. No. Legally, I'm out of range. Paper sticks. This fucking camera. And I have a starch cola addiction that will never go away. Design. <gasps> I could use this to cut a thousand dollars off of my debt. I could use that to cut a thousand dollars off the debt. <laughs> Don't fucking kill me. Doctors don't know how to treat my illness. They're gonna misdiagnose it. They're gonna let me wake up and I'm gonna be so thirsty for cola. And when I, when I check my inventory, I'm not paying shit. When I check my inventory, they forgot to take my diamond. Oh, that's good. <clears throat> you know, doctor, takes a lot more than that to kill me. I'm afraid I can't stay here anymore. Bro! Bro! Talk to me, Andy! No, 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 no! 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 Oh, fuck! Just don't take the diamond. No! 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 It, it, it automatically. Oh, guys! It just, it just used it. It just used my money. Wait. It cured me. Am I? Ah, uh, no! I'm still addicted. Nope. That goes all my money. Guys, it's okay. I have a diamond. Guys, look, I have a I have a chaos emerald. Look. Look. In my hand. I have a chaos emerald. No one else has one of these. 
<gasps> my diamond! Back off! I'll fucking kill you. I will fucking kill you. Give me this. Bloody bruiser. Where is he? 1203 Gray Heights. I don't have time for that. Right now, what I need to do is go to a pawn shop to pawn off. God, there's a lot of short people in this city. I need to go to a pawn shop so I can pawn off a, a diamond. But the last pawn shop I went to tragically had no one working at it and may never have had anyone working at it. Because I only see the one place. Last time I was there, there was no one else in it. I think whoever worked there might have died. I have to get there before I die of my addiction. No! 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 Please be open. Please, 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 God be open. If you're not open, I'm just gonna help myself to some money from the back. This is a bathroom. This ain't the back. This is a bathroom. Who works here, man? <laughs> you don't have a shot, asshole. Ow! Doctor! Doctor, I need starch cola or I'll fucking die! I'll pay the bill. It's okay, guys. I don't have any money. They can't subtract anything from zero. That's illegal. I'm cured of my addiction. See? I'm now free to live my life. Oh! Back to solving the crimes of this city, just like Batman. Am I fell. Nice shins, dipshit. I lived, dipshit. Hey. You guys got soda? No? Okay, I'm just gonna make my way to the crime scene. For that horrible, horrible crime scene at 12.03. No, I gotta go to the- I gotta go to the- I gotta go to the hotel. No, 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 no. I gotta- I gotta load up. <laughs> you guys know me. Alright? I, I gotta load up. I gotta load up. On starch. With what money? I just gotta solve, I just gotta solve this murder without any starch in my system, it's fine. I just gotta solve this, I gotta solve one murder with no starch. I can handle that, I need this. I can handle that. I'll be fine. Listen, Starch Cola loves me. They would never try to hurt me. I heard there was a murder in this building. 
On the fucking 12th floor? Yeah, I'm gonna take the elevator. Say that to me again and I'll beat your ass. Do you understand me? My plunger! Alright, guys. We just have to solve this mystery before I go into full withdrawal. I give it at least... I got at least 30 minutes. I got at least 30 minutes. Check the clock. Echelon zone. I'm in. Ah! Guys, I don't think I have clearance to go into an echelon zone. <laughs> Guys, that was my first time going up to an echelon zone. I'm going to be honest. I walked in and they shot me instantaneously and then detained me. And... <gasps> Doctor, you have to give me soda. I'm just gonna go back to sleep. They'll feed me soda while I sleep. I'm, guys, it, it's over. All right, listen. Another timeline of Grup Grumble. Every timeline of Grup Grumble, we learn something new about the character, and things get just a lot more miserable. And this timeline, he in, he he took out a loan for starch cola, which actually fundamentally made him addicted to starch cola. And now I have no way to financially recover from my debt, meaning I am eternally addicted to soda. I might just make it to the building before my addiction starts zonking my vision. There is not a single chance. That's the building way over there. There's no way. There's just no way. I'm already- I didn't even make it to the fucking door. I'd have to wait for the elevator to come back down. It's so over. Out of my way! Move! <laughs> Turn the elevator down. I might have to push someone down the elevator shaft later. Might be one of the only ways we can actually get this... ...officer off of the case. Out of my way! Only on the sixth floor? My god, I'm gonna be freaking I'm gonna be withdrawn completely by the time I get up top. This is insane. This made me want to stop drinking soda? You're welcome. You won't fucking kill me! I'm about to make another murder weapon out of this murder weapon, dude, I swear to fucking god. Put a pin in it. Put some life into it. <sighs> you think this rich fucking bastard had some... Had some soda? Business card. Didn't have what it takes. Cut to the chase. They must be worthy. Aiden Mitchell. How do I know that? Wait, how do- Wait, who- who do- How- Wait a minute! <laughs> Wait a minute! I already know Aiden! <laughs> They're one of the fun- Dude, Aiden Mitchell, I think, gave me their name on the street at some point! I met him before! These Dude, this is how we bring it back! This is how we bring it back! I already know the serial killer! <laughs> I've already got his fingerprints on file. We're gonna be able to afford starch cola. That's Aiden Mitchell, dude. Belongs to Aiden Mitchell. Okay. Oh my guy. That was the guy who liked sports. That was him. That was sports guy. That's the guy who we were all like, wait a minute. <laughs> We've, that guy likes sports. He's volatile. He had three strikes, remember? <laughs> <laughs> I, had, I had a feeling this guy was going to come back up. Oh, <laughs> back to Cyber Chase. Oh my fucking god, Smoldering Incorporated, 
He's a QA technician. Ain't no way. Ain't no fucking way. And to think I'm doing this all while frothing at the mouth, hands shaking, eyes going cross-eyed. Holy shit. He was bludgeoned to death. The, I'm pretty sure I have the murder weapon in my hands because I stole it. Like, I gotta take your fa Yi Jun Qu Oh my god. Wait. I also know them because they're the fucking office manager of Smoldering Incorporated. <laughs> Co worker moment. <laughs> well, we solved all. This might be the fastest mystery I ever solved, guys. All I'm saying. All I'm saying is, uh, maybe some of it had to do with the fact that I, uh, I was zonked on, uh, starch cola. <laughs> half the, half the people who work at this building are fucking dead. Put a pin in it. I mean, they're not gonna need any of this shit. I'm gonna help myself to some of this stuff. I, I just gotta, where's their kitchen? This is the tiniest echelon building I've ever seen. They don't have a kitchen. I thought like the echelon ones were like really fancy. Fuck. Hang on. So I have evidence that places the killer at the scene of the crime. Hang on, if I pull... Hang on, let me just... Inspect, I'm gonna scan this. Literally, Aiden Mitchell left the murder weapon in the room with him. You gotta be kidding me. He actually- that was the murder- He left his fingerprints all over it and then ran out of the room. So yeah, I have the murder weapon in my hand. And I almost used it to murder someone else. And I may still. Alright. It's the murder weapon. Boom. Evidence that places the killer at the scene of the crime as well. With, um, this business card. Both of these have his fingerprints on them. This is the easiest crime I've ever done. And I think I already have- I- Guys, I don't even have to go to his fucking place of business to- I'm pretty sure I have his address somewhere in here. Wait, no I don't. But I can just go into the phone book and look- I don't- I literally don't have to talk to Aiden. This guy is going to be walking home five minutes after the murder took place? And he's not going to make it to the door because I used cola to dilate time, solve the crime. He, he's not going to make it home. I'm just going to look up, look him up on the phone book. It's because you're Aiden Mitchell. No, no, no. Uh. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and solve this one quick and then I'll get down. Guys, listen, everything's going to be fine, guys. Listen, we're going to solve. There's no way they don't have Aiden in this thing. There we go, Par 201 Parker Tower. Aiden. He lives in 201 Parker Tower, we got him. Boom. I'll go ahead and punch us all in. Full name of the killer. Aiden Mitchell. We have evidence in place to kill her at the scene of the crime. Technically the hammer is the best evidence. Uh, because it's also the murder weapon. Uh, where does the killer live? 201 Park Tower. I did not arrest him. Uh... Plot route to hand it in. All right, it's that way. All right, guys, come on. Let's get down there and solve this freaking case. Let me just... Whoa! I'm not gonna make it all the way down, guys, without fucking, like, ODing on starch cola, so this is actually the fastest way to get to City Hall. I'll never make it to City Hall before I OD on Starch Cola withdrawal or whatever the fuck. This is the best way to do it. Yeah, you don't understand. I solved the case. I solved the case. You don't understand. Uh, take these three dollars from me and cure me of my disease. Put some life into it 
Wait, who fucked up this window? What the? And who glued this freaking fire extinguisher to the ground? Some people have no respect. All right, let's go tell them. Let's go tell the people. Oh my God. Guys, listen, people were saying it's so over. Even I was saying it's so over, but I think I just came back. I think I just came back. I think I'm back online. Yeah, I solved the mystery. You're welcome. Yeah. What do you think? I'm addicted to starch cola, did you know that? Dude, the most... The most evidence to placing him at the scene of the crime is me having a, the murder weapon he dropped on the ground. In the scene of the crime! What do you mean? Enable fast travel to your apartment is my newest perk. Gee willikers. That'd be so cool if I had one. Close the case. Guys. 335 bucks. That's just enough money to buy five or six cans of soda. Think about it. How much is a can of soda here? 35. Cheapest I've seen so far. Oh, fuck. I didn't know if I was ever going to get to partake in that delicious soda ever again. I'm gonna buy a couple. Inventory's full. What good is this diamond if I can't use it? Hey, hey you! 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 Here. I wanna give you this once you're done pissing. That was a fucking hard diamond. Oh. Uh. I mean, I know they're hard, but I didn't think it would be... They must have had a soft part of their skull. Is it really that good? What the fuck is this? I gotta get out of here. We're cool. We're cool. Well, now I know that diamonds um, are certainly instant uh, kill items. That's good. Waldo. Oh, I used to live a life like you before I got addicted. Addicted to starch. Uh. Ah, you know how hard it is to live a life like this. Only people like you and me really get it. You addicted to starch cola too, man? Are you also addicted to the starch cola, man? Yeah. Yeah. I get by by, uh... By, by solving murders. Uh, it's been a kind of a dry spell on murders lately is the problem. No one really knows, uh... No one really knows when the next murder is going to happen. Guys, to them, I was in a conversation with them, continued the conversation, and left. Like, while talking. Like, I I just... I, <laughs> I just left. I didn't even finish the dialogue with them. Oh, hang on. Now sit more. Hey. You walk in the same way as me, champ? Whoa, twins. Sorry, that was actually really rude. I'm gonna go. So how hard is a diamond? Let me just...
We lost him. Hey, don't go out there. There's psychos out there. You got any money? Hell no? Okay, I get it. I'll get it, man. You have a good day now. Well, listen, if you have any money, you need to give it to me, all right? It's the law. Knife. Huh. Guys, you see, this is actually making me a way stronger detective because I'm gonna know everyone in the city like long before I actually need to know them. Like, I know who this is, because I just went through their wallet while they were sleeping. Every day I get stronger, because I'm doing crimes. I think here's probably a good stopping point for today, either way, though. I don't think we're gonna top the full, like, double full circle ending that we just had there. I think it's uh, I think it's a good wrap up point for this update. Cool shit, cool shit. We'll loop back around to this game when there's more content, as always, as always. Gonna make a save for this one though, just in case, because you never know when you might be able to actually continue the save in a future update. But yeah, we're done. I will catch you all, uh, maybe tomorrow at the usual time. If not, then Monday. Thanks for coming on by. I appreciate it. Probably going to be streaming tomorrow, though. I'm not even going to say it's a maybe. Uh, and we will most likely, uh, by all accounts, be streaming tomorrow. Uh, so I'll see you then. Thanks for coming by. Laters.